Chapter 1, Apprentice Pirates of the Roger Pirates Advertisement See Circle Calendar 1492 Eight years have passed since the Valley of God's War that shook the world. And For this sea, what disappears will only be forgotten forever. Even the rocks pirate, which was once invincible in the sea, has disappeared from everyone's field of vision in just eight years under the control of caring people and the selective forgetting of everyone. As if it never existed. Now resounding across the sea, it is the three big pirate groups that cross the new world. Roger Pirates, the captain is G.O.L.D. Roger. The White Beard Pirates, captained by Edward Newgate. The Flying Pirates, captained by Shiki. The captain of the three big pirate groups, also known as the three legendary pirates on the sea. Besides, there are also Big Mom Pirates, Wufeng Pirates, Silver Axe Pirates, John Pirates, Ward Pirates, Eight Treasure Marines, Chef Pirates, Beasts Pirates, and Baba as a Lone Ranger. Loric Redfield. All in all, these people have constructed this brand new era of pirates. New World. Advertisement. The Oro Jackson. As one of the three legendary pirates, the pirate ship of the Roger Pirates was built by the world's number one shipbuilder, Tom the Murloc. It was built with the treasure tree Adam, and it incorporates many superb skills. The pirate ship can be called the top pirate ship in the world. At the same time, compared with the white beard pirates and the flying pirates, the Roger Pirates are the rarest. The overall number is only about 30 people. Ken. It is with these 30 people that they can become one of the three legendary pirates that keep pace with each other, which is enough to prove how amazing the overall strength of the Roger Pirates is. Snapped. Snapped. Following the sound of footsteps, a man with a golden back and gold-rimmed glasses came out. He looked around with a smile on his face, and said casually, Jabba. The sunshine today is really good. Yes. Another man with long hair came out, wearing round black sunglasses, smiling and looking into the distance. Silver Rayleigh. Copper Jabba. These two people are the real right and left hands of the Roger Pirates. The two of them are looking into the distance. The plan of the day is in the morning, and the two of them get up very early. Rayleigh. Jabba. Ha ha ha. With this grinning grin, a man ran out quickly, wearing a captain's coat and a captain's cap. That extremely hacky beard was actually nose hair. He ran out with the news, excited he said, look at it. Look at it. Recently, there is a kid who is making a big fuss in this sea. Advertisement. Um. Both Rayleigh and Jabba were taken aback. They took the news and read it carefully. Douglas Bullet. Whispering the name, Rayleigh thought about it, and said, A boy born in the Grand Line National of Endless Wars has already destroyed his own country and army at a young age, so he went to sea. Indeed. Jabba also agreed, In this sea, there will always be such young people. It's not surprising. On this sea, there are countless people who go to sea because of war and chaos. Even Linlin, Kaido, and Newgate who are resounding in the sea now, these guys count as one, but they are all because they can't survive, or abandoned, and forced to go to sea. There is no way. In this dangerous sea, if you are not cruel enough, you will not be able to survive. He he he. Roger smiled and said, So, really? Jabba. Do you think this kid is very interesting, he looks very confused. Rayleigh shook his head and said, Roger, are you going to invite Bullet to join our Roger Pirates? Well. Roger said casually, I do have this idea, after all. Such a confused brat, help him find the meaning of life. Rayleigh and Jabba both laughed and said nothing, but they knew that even though their captain said so, in reality. Purely because. The captain of my family likes to play and thinks this kid is very interesting, so he plans to invite him to board the ship. Reason. There is no reason. This is the only reason, 
and it is enough to find it interesting. Ha ha ha. Advertisement. Roger laughed and said, Okay. That's the decision. When we meet this brat, we'll invite him to board the ship. Rayleigh put away the newspaper and said, According to Bullet's personality, if there is no accident, he will come to challenge you soon, and now he is like a headless chicken, full of madness. But. Jabba rubbed his chin, but thought about it, Roger, Rayleigh, how do you guys think this kid named Bullet compares to Arthur? What? Jabba. Stop messing around, how could he compare to Arthur? Yes. Yes. There is no comparison. Two tall figures came out. They were the fighters of the Roger Pirates, the tallest Chikarl and San Bell, the second tallest Murloc. They came out together. Obviously. It is very dissatisfied that Jabba compares Bullet to Arthur in their mouth. Ha ha ha. Jabba grinned and said, Well. No matter how you say it, Bullet is already 15 years old, while Arthur is only 9 years old. If there is a real fight, Bullet may really be stronger. Rayleigh thought for a while, but retorted, That's not what you said. Although Arthur is said to be an apprentice pirate, but Arthur's strength is extremely strong, and Bullet really isn't necessarily Arthur's opponent. Rayleigh, Jabba, West Carl, San Bell, and the people who gradually gathered around began to discuss whether Bullet was stronger or Arthur was stronger. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. On the first day of uploading 10 updates started. The first update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the seven day long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 2, Arthur Pendragon. Advertisement. Captain. Mr. Rayleigh. Mr. Jabba. What are you arguing about? At this time, a childish voice that gave people a feeling of being in the spring breeze came, and a child who was only about eight or nine years old came out from the cabin. He had golden hair and the corners of his mouth with a smile, she has a pair of emerald green eyes that are like jewels. Arthur. Seeing the child, San Bell immediately walked over and picked the child up. The child named Arthur said helplessly, Mr. San Bell, what's the matter? Arthur Pendragon. This has been his name all his life. Um. That's right. Arthur is a time traveler. Eight years ago, he time traveled and became a one-year-old child. As a result, the place he crossed happened to be the Valley of the Gods. It can be said that he was in the corner and witnessed that devastating event with his own eyes. Valley of the Gods War According to the later legend, some people say that the Valley of the Gods was buried after that war and was wiped out from the sea. Actually, Arthur can tell you very clearly that the Valley of the Gods was not buried, but was actually destroyed directly after that war. Advertisement After that, Arthur, who was only one year old, was adopted by Roger and became a trainee pirate of the Roger Pirates. Eight years have passed in a flash, and Arthur is now nine years old. As for why it is called Arthur Pendragon? Name, Arthur Pendragon. Noble Phantasm, the Sword of Promised Victory, Thirteen Seals Unlocked, the Spear that Shines at the End, Unlocked, Distant Gensikyo, Unlocked. Bloodline, Red Dragon Bloodline, Unawakened, Island Power, Unawakened. Knight's Dash. British Isles. The City of Chalk. Hacky, Conqueror's Hacky, Unawakened, Armament Hacky, Beginner, Observation Hacky, Beginner. This is Arthur's panel. From the beginning of time travel. Arthur found that he had inherited the old sword, Arthur Pendragon's template and his own name naturally became Arthur Pendragon. But, looking at his own template, 
he knew that apart from unlocking the Sword of Oath of Victory, what Red Dragon bloodline has not been awakened, Holy Gun. Scabbard. It's all unawakened, as for everything else. That is a purely polished commander. Of course. Arthur is also a little puzzled, does he still have the power of the island? The power of the island should be the power possessed by my sister, Morgan Elife. As the last gathering place of mythology, the British Isle possesses infinite power, and in each generation of the British Isle, two children will be born. King. One has the blood of the red dragon. Advertisement. One has the blood of a white dragon. This is all very easy to understand, and at the same time, as the myth continued to dissipate, the British Isle was unwilling to dissipate like this, and an owner who inherited the power of his own island was also born. In other words, Morgan Elife is actually more suitable to be the King of Britain than Arthur. Of course. This is just a saying. In fact, everything is predestined and cannot be changed at all. Arthur is most confused about this point. He also has the power of the island. However, I didn't think too much about it. After all, it has already appeared on the attribute panel, so it must be there, but what awakening is not necessarily true. Now my red dragon bloodline is not awakened yet. Only. Arthur's system is a 3 no system, according to his own research, first of all. To unlock the seal of the holy sword, you need to work hard on your own, to awaken the blood of the red dragon, you need to work hard on your own, to unlock the holy gun, to unlock the scabbard, eh. All need to work hard. As for the call of the Knights of the Round Table, the British Isles, and the City of Chalk. These require pure energy, which is devil fruit. Other than that, the rest is all to do by yourself. Arthur really has an MMP urge, emotion. Young master, I inherited a cheat, and the result is a cheat like this, a pure three no system? But? Arthur has nothing to do with it, relying on himself is worse than relying on the sky and the earth, this kind of three no cheat, maybe this is the only benefit. At this time, Arthur was continuing to look at his own template, Sanbel had already carried Arthur into the crowd, and that was how he put Arthur down. Ugh. Arthur sighed helplessly, raised his head and said, Mr. Rayleigh, what's the matter? Wow. Advertisement. What? Both Roger and Jabba were very upset in an instant, and said, Arthur. It's very natural for you to pass us too. Captain Roger. Mr. Jabba. You. As Arthur talked, he fell into silence. At this moment, silence is worth a thousand words. Ha ha ha. Everyone in the Roger Pirates couldn't help laughing, it was so embarrassing. So embarrassing. This is really too embarrassing. Everyone couldn't help shaking their heads. Although there were no words, only calm silence, this kind of silence was the most ironic. He he he. Ignoring Roger and Jabba, whose faces were turning blue, Rayleigh handed over the newspaper and said with a smile, We're just discussing, who is stronger, Arthur or Bullet? Douglas Bullet. Arthur was taken aback for a moment, and then flipped through the newspaper in his hand. Sure enough, seeing the familiar figure, he thought secretly in his heart, according to the time, it should be this year. Bullet is going to join the Roger Pirates. But. Arthur shook his head and said with a smile, Mr. Rayleigh, I haven't fought in person, so no one knows who is stronger or weaker, but. After all, they are all contemporaries, and I don't think I am weaker than anyone. Arthur's words were soft and calm, but in the calm, he was full of absolute confidence. P.S. Zio King's new book is uploaded. On the first day of uploading 10 updates started. The second update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the seven day long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. 
Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 3, Trainee Trio, Real 4 Emperors Fight. Advertisement. Roger, Rayleigh, Java, West Carl, Sand Bell. Everyone was smiling when they heard Arthur's words. In this sea, it's not scary to be weak, and it's not scary to be young. What's scary is. You have lost your enterprising heart. If you deny yourself and feel that you are not an opponent, then you are really not an opponent. Ha ha ha. Roger laughed and patted Arthur on the shoulder, and said with a big grin, Arthur. I am optimistic about you. If Bullet, a kid, comes to the door one day, you will be the one to face him. Captain Roger. No problem, no problem. Only. It hurts. Arthur couldn't help rolling his eyes, and said, Captain Roger, you're retaliating. What? Roger seemed to be taken aback for a moment, and then said carelessly, How is it possible? Impossible. Impossible. Absolutely impossible. I'm not that kind of person. He <laughs> he. For this Captain Roger who is like a living treasure, the future One Piece, Arthur is just two words. Ha ha ha. Seeing this scene, everyone couldn't help laughing. After the quarrel is over, it will naturally disperse, and everyone has their own things to do. Arthur also started his daily training and training after having breakfast. Huh. Huh. Breathing out deeply, Arthur's eyes were unusually serious, and he waved the ape specially made for himself by Mr. Rayleigh in his hand to forge his body. Advertisement. At the beginning, Rayleigh didn't want Arthur to exercise like this, his body was prone to accidents, and it turned out. Surprisingly, although Arthur said he was very tired, his body recovered almost immediately the next day. I can't even imagine it. Of course. Arthur himself is very clear, although his red dragon blood has not been awakened, but... After all, I have the blood of the red dragon, and I am a humanoid red dragon. This kind of resilience is just sprinkling water. After knowing Arthur's special physical condition, Rayleigh didn't care about it, but he formulated strict training methods for Arthur. 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 At this time, two children came out of the cabin, one with red hair, a long knife hanging from his waist, and one with a red nose, and two short swords hanging around his waist. They were shanks and buggy. Huh. Arthur just finished exercising, took a long breath, put down the ape in his hand, and wiped his sweat, shanks, buggy, you two got up late again. What? Not at all joke. Upon hearing this, both Shanks and Buggy were reluctant. Shanks said unhappily, it's not that I got up late, it's not Buggy, who doesn't get up when I say anything. Shanks. Buggy roared angrily, it's obvious that you are lying in bed. What? Want to fight? Come. Look at the fist. Look at the fight. Shanks and Buggy began to fight back and forth, Watching this scene, Arthur fell into a kind of silent contemplation. Advertisement. Hmm. How to say. These two. Although they are only nine years old now, in the future they will all be the pinnacles of the sea. As the four emperors who rule the sea, although Buggy's four emperors do have a lot of moisture. But. Arthur is very clear, Buggy's talent is actually very good, just. There was a slight accident. Buggy ate chop chop fruit and lost his treasure map. As a result, Buggy was decadent. He went to sea ten years later than he expected. He was ten years decadent. Time of year. It turned out to be baboons. Otherwise. At a young age, Buggy and Shanks were remembered by Newgate together. From this, it can be seen that Buggy's talent is definitely not weak. Not to mention, Arthur has been exercising with Shanks and Buggy for a long time. 
Does anyone have a better say than himself about the level of the other two members of his apprentice trio? He he he. Watching the fight between the two, Aaron couldn't help but diverge, and couldn't help thinking of the scene where the four emperors met. Shanks and Newgate met, and the iconic sky cracked. The match between Kaido and Linlin, Lin, the iconic sky split. The match between Luffy and Kaido, the iconic sky split. Um. As four emperors, if you can't beat the sky, you will be ashamed to say that you are four emperors. Only. Shanks, how dare you hit me on the nose. You redhead. Red nose, how dare you grab my hair. Shanks and Buggy are fighting in full swing, the punches are painful to watch. Arthur whispered softly, maybe, this is the real battle between the four emperors. Advertisement. True four emperors fight each other. Really are. Rayleigh and Jabba watched the two men walk over helplessly, and then pulled them away. Rayleigh said helplessly, Shanks, Buggy, you two calm down a little bit, really? Calm down a little bit. Humph. Both Shanks and Buggy glared at each other. He he he. Arthur couldn't help chuckling and said, Shanks, Buggy, you two are not too tired. You come here once a day. You can fight for various reasons, and you don't know what to say. Arthur. Both Shanks and Buggy ran towards Arthur and jumped on him. Really? Rayleigh looked at the three people who were fighting each other and shook his head helplessly. After all, they were still a group of children. It's not surprising. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. On the first day of uploading ten updates started. The third update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Add more rules. The new issue adds more rules. 3000 flowers plus a new chapter. 1000 evaluation votes plus a new chapter. 30 monthly tickets plus one more chapter. Add a new chapter to the 50th floor. 3 rewards plus a new chapter. There is no ceiling. Brothers who know Xiaoqing should know that Xioqing's update frequency is definitely not a problem, brothers. As long as the data is enough, Xiaoqing will give you crazy updates. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 4, Encounter Burndy. Colliding Conquerors. Advertisement. Snapped. Snapped. Shanks and Buggy have been thrown to the ground. Arthur clapped his hands calmly, as if this was nothing at all. Really? Rayleigh looked at the two people lying on the ground and rolled around, and said with a light smile, You two guys have to work hard, every time you challenge Arthur, you are no match, if you continue to lose like this again and again, it will be embarrassing yes. It hurts. Shanks struggled to get up, rubbed his stomach, and couldn't help complaining, Arthur, you're getting harder and harder. Arthur smiled and said, don't worry, there won't be any bruises, but it will be more painful. Isn't that even more excessive? He he he. Ha ha ha. Everyone couldn't help laughing, everyone smiled and shook their heads, actually. Everyone is used to this situation, after all. No matter how it is said, they have known it for so many years. Arthur, Shanks, Buggy and the other two children are okay, but Arthur is more mature and is studying hard in all aspects. Whether it is the improvement of strength, medical skills, shipbuilding, sailing, cooking, in short, in all aspects, Arthur is very serious and studies very hard, and under such circumstances. Everyone even doubted whether Arthur could hold on. Ken. The truth is, Arthur not only held on, but held on very firmly. Advertisement. I can only say. It's really different from person to person. Arthur is very clear about this, 
he has his own ambitions, he has inherited everything from Arthur Pendragon, if this is the case. Then I am Arthur Pendragon, and I want to rebuild the brand new British Empire in this world. And because of this, I need to work harder and harder, not only to grow in strength, but also to learn in all aspects, and the Roger Pirates can't last long. Follow the time in the original book. In another five years at most, the Roger Pirates will be disbanded, and at that time, the era of great pirates will begin, and before that, I must make all preparations. Shanks. Buggy. Training, training, you two don't be lazy. Coming. After the fight, Arthur resumed swinging his epee, while Shanks and Buggy also ran over and started continuous training. Doing it yourself seems to be quite ruthless, but in fact, it is just a little painful, and there will be no problem in essence. It's really good. Rayleigh also shook his head with an emotional smile, without saying anything. He turned his head to look at Roger, but secretly said in his heart, Roger, how will you choose the next path? These three each child is a perfect fit. Never mind. Don't think too much about it. Rayleigh shook his head, he didn't continue to think more deeply, there are some things that other people don't know, but don't Rayleigh and Jabba know? Especially about Roger's thoughts. Only. These things are not suitable for me and others to participate in, so let Roger make his own choices. Duration of time. Advertisement. It always goes by very fast. Half a month passed in a flash. Arthur, Shanks, and Buggy are still training day after day. Under Arthur's stimulation, Shanks naturally needless to say, and Buggy, who likes to steal and play tricks, is also forced to start hard training. No way. Can't beat Arthur has been like this for so many years, but I can't even beat Shanks, can I? That's a shame. It's just a loss of life. Because of this, Buggy is also an exceptionally hard workout. It can be said. Although Arthur's strength is still weak, but above the sea, this butterfly has already started to trigger different effects. Um. Oh. Coming. Suddenly. Everyone in the Roger Pirates raised their heads suddenly, and smiles appeared on the corners of their mouths in unison. Really? Next moment. A round of shells swept over in an instant. Burndy Pirates. Burndy. Rayleigh and Jabba shot at the same time, cutting shells one after another in an instant. Everyone was already used to such a scene. There is no so-called peace in the sea. Arthur, Shanks, and Jabba each clenched their weapons. They are not very old, but above the sea, there is no room for retreat. No matter facing any opponent, they have to go up instead of retreating. Advertisement. Roger. A ferocious, rampant voice came out. This is a tall figure dressed like a viking. On his shoulder is a skinny man who looks like a small human. Look at that the appearance is the appearance of being crumbling to death. Ha ha ha. Burndy. Roger also laughed sassily, and said, it really is you. Burndy Wald. Captain of the Ward Pirates. He used to yearn for freedom, but as his strength grew, he was destroying everything he saw, whether it was pirates, marines, or civilians, everything he saw would be destroyed. Therefore, he is also called World Destroyer by the Sea. Roger. Burndy. Both Roger and Burndy were standing on the bow of the ship, the sound of gunfire around them was churning crazily, and the eyes of the two were also unusually sharp, just staring at each other like this. Suddenly. Boom. A dark purple air burst out from both of them at the same time, it was Conqueror's Hacky. As the top pirate on the sea, their Conqueror's Hacky was equally terrifying. Crackling. A stream of dark purple air surged, and in an instant, under this endless collision, everyone in the pirate groups on both sides felt tremendous pressure. Chapter 5, Awakened Red Dragon Bloodline. Awakened Conqueror's Hacky. Advertisement. Do not doubt. 
Under the strongman's conqueror's hedge, even the top strongman will feel a sense of oppression. In other words, if it is conqueror's hacky, it is really strong enough, even if it is admiral, vice admiral, and other strong men. Even unbearable. What? Exactly. That's Shanks. Of course. For the pirate groups on both sides, they are the top pirate groups sailing in the Sea of New World. The collision of Roger and Burndy. Of course it was the collision of the two captains. Ken. This kind of conqueror's hacky still can't affect both sides, just. For Arthur, Shanks, and Buggy, the influence of these three children is slightly greater. Humph. All three of them couldn't help but groan. During these eight years, the Roger pirates fought against other pirates again and again. Only. This is the first time the three little guys have faced such a positive confrontation, the conqueror's hedge of the two top powerhouses. So sad. Shanks clutched his chest and opened his mouth, as if he wanted to take a big breath, but he couldn't do it at all. It felt like his heart was about to stop suddenly. Advertisement. Buggy's facial features were distorted, and he said with an ugly face, Damn it. Is this Captain Rogers Conqueror's hacky? It's totally unimaginable. Shanks. Buggy. Rayleigh looked at the two children, and said softly in his heart, This is a very important test for you, no matter when you are on the sea, you have to face any test, and this is just the beginning. At the same time, Rayleigh looked at Arthur, who was far better than Shanks and Buggy. Although the small face also looked pale, but overall, it was relatively calm. Arthur. Rayleigh secretly said, compared to Shanks and Buggy, Arthur is better in every aspect. The future of this child is really exciting. But. Rayleigh didn't know, and no one knew, that Arthur's heart was beating wildly at this moment. Crackling. Crackling. Especially as the conqueror's confrontation between the two became more and more terrifying, the surrounding air began to distort, and dark purple thunderbolts began to burst out, bursting like substantial thunder. Under such circumstances, Arthur felt endless pressure. Bump. Bump. My heart was beating crazily. Under such terrifying pressure, my heart seemed to be distorted. It could even be said that a scorching airflow had slowly emerged from my heart. Out. So hot. So hot. Arthur's voice was very low, so low that it was almost inaudible. Advertisement. Ken. Horrific waves of heat emerged from Arthur's heart. For mythical dragons, the most important thing is the heart, and many dragon-slaying heroes are bathed in the blood of the dragon's heart. This moment. Arthur's heart was beating violently, and even began to burn hotly. Roar. In an instant. Arthur's soul seemed to have changed. Along with the violently beating scorching heart, a roaring red dragon emerged from Arthur's phantom. Um. This kind of change is naturally not felt by others, but it is completely different for Roger. Roger was born with top-level observation hacky, that is, the ability to listen to the voice of all things. He was keenly aware that a huge change was taking place in Arthur's body, and what exactly was this change? Roger is not sure yet. But. The corner of Roger's mouth curled up, and he said in a low voice, Arthur. Then, let me help you. Burndy. Boom. Roger let out a deafening roar, and the next moment, accompanied by H.A. Wan's overlord-like laughter, the even more terrifying conqueror's hacky burst out completely, and the endless dark purple airflow had completely overwhelmed him. It was covered all around, and it no longer just formed a dark purple thunder, but formed a scene like a dense fog. Roger. You bastard, are you provoking? With the roar of anger, Burndy also let out a deafening roar. He was not afraid at all, and released his conqueror's hacky even more terrifyingly. Crackling. The conqueror's hacky of the two collided crazily. In a short time, it formed a terrifying thunder that seemed to tear everything apart. 
Wisps of dark purple thick fog mixed with dark purple thunder seem to be about to tear apart everything. Tear everything apart. Advertisement. Humph. What? Shanks and Buggy endured the conqueror's hacky of the two, and finally couldn't bear it anymore, and passed out with their eyes rolled white. Roar. But Arthur was different. Under the conqueror's hacky that continued to intensify, Arthur let out a terrifying roar, and the emerald green pupils of his eyes turned into blood-red vertical pupils in an instant. Boom. The heart was beating violently, and the sleeping red dragon in his soul was completely awakened. Arthur's blood of the red dragon was completely awakened. At the same time. Wave. Everyone is silent, Rayleigh, Jabba, West Carl, San Bell, everyone in the Roger Pirates, everyone in the Burndy Pirates, Guy Ram, Nathan, Sebastian, etc., and many others the Cotters fell into silence. Everyone's eyes widened in disbelief, and they looked at Arthur with round eyes, like vertical pupils, in disbelief. Conqueror's hacky. How could it be possible? What? Everyone is dumbfounded. That's right. The breath burst out from Arthur's body, accompanied by the awakening of the blood of the red dragon, and what burst out instantly was Conqueror's hacky. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. On the first day of uploading 10 updates started. Fifth update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 6, Awakening Conqueror's Apprentice Pirate. Advertisement. Humph. Arthur let out a muffled snort and the red vertical pupils returned to emerald green pupils like blue waves. When he closed his eyes, he passed out directly. Obviously. Arthur had completely reached his limit. Only. Roger and Burndy, even all the pirates on both sides looked at Arthur silently. Conqueror's hacky. That's Conqueror's hacky. How old is Arthur now? Nine years old. The nine-year-old kid actually awakened Conqueror's hacky? FK. I can't even imagine it, okay. In the silence, Burndy asked, Roger, how old is this kid in your family? Roger also said a little stiffly, as far as Arthur is concerned, he should be nine years old this year. Is this an apprentice pirate? Yes. The two asked and answered, and those who didn't know thought the two were such good friends, but it was just. This is purely an instinctive reaction. Advertisement. Even the two who were traveling across the sea were completely stupefied at this moment. Obediently. Is this too shocking? Conqueror's hacky. As the most powerful hacky among conquerors hacky, it is said that there is only a one in a million probability of awakening, and only those who possess the qualifications to become the overlord can awaken. Of course. In the new world, Conqueror's hacky is, frankly, worthless. Put another way. In new world, having Conqueror's hacky doesn't mean you are strong, but being a strong person must have Conqueror's hacky, but? Even so, the two of them have never met before, this kid who is only nine years old has awakened Conqueror's hacky. Monster. Evildoer. Do not. Do not. I don't even know how to describe it, it gives people a very strange, even very weird feeling, and I don't know how to describe it at all. Ha ha ha. Roger was the first to react, and said with a sassy smile, as expected of Arthur. He is really good enough. For Roger, he has no children, and he treats Arthur, Shanks, and Buggy as his own children. At this moment, seeing how outstanding his children are, of course he is very satisfied. As Roger reacted, others also reflected the same, but the same thing is, everyone is laughing and roaring, they are all very happy. 
Advertisement Just like Roger, Roger regards the three little devils as his own children, and they are the same. After all, they are a group of bear commanders or bear female commanders. Of course, their attitude towards their own children is different. Asshole. Burndy roared angrily, Roger, don't be too arrogant, you're just a brat. Exactly. I'll kill you and this brat today. Momo 100 times gun. Burndy took out a pistol, and the bullets fired instantly expanded 100 times, at the same time. Covered with jet black armament hacky, the power of this bullet is already many times more terrifying than that of a cannonball. Ken. To Roger, such an attack was nothing worth mentioning. Brush. The ace at the waist was unsheathed, and Roger flashed across like an afterimage in an instant, splitting the bullet in two, and Roger was also in mid-air, stepping on the mid-air, just like walking in the air, headed straight for Burndy, hmm. Isn't there anyone who can't do such a simple technique as moonwalk? God slash. Momo 100 times punch. Burndy was not afraid of Roger's attack at all, even if the opponent used Ace, one of the twelve great swords, he still stepped on the moonwalk to meet him. Momo fruit. As a devil fruit that can expand any object from one to one hundred times, not only can expand the object, even the conceptual fist, speed, force, these can be expanded, but? The premise is that you have a high enough level of development of devil fruit, and your physical fitness is strong enough, then you can bear it, otherwise, you can't bear it. Bump. Roger and Burndy fought, and the two passed each other in an instant. And at the same time. Advertisement. Rayleigh also drew the long knife from his waist and shouted, Attack. Attack. The deputy captain of the ward pirates, Biajak, also gave the order to attack. The two sides quickly fought together. Some went straight to each other, while others drove the pirate ship. The helmsman of both sides quickly controlled the pirate. The ship launched a very standard naval battle between the two pirate groups when they met on the sea. But, these things have nothing to do with Arthur, Shanks, and Buggy, and the three little guys just passed out. Rayleigh commanded at the same time, Max Max, send all three children to the cabin, don't let them die in such a melee. No problem. Rayleigh. Rayleigh is commanding a man with a big black beard, moon tattoos on the left side of his neck and left arm, and a very burly physique. In the Roger Pirates, he is almost second only to West Carl and San Bell, and he is also one of the combatants. Max picked up the three little ghosts with one hand, rushed into the cabin quickly, placed the three of them in their own rooms, walked out of the cabin, nodded to Rayleigh, and then jumped in he joined the battlefield directly with a big laugh. Hmm. Rayleigh didn't join the fight, but looked around. He needed to guard the three little guys a little bit, so that there wouldn't be any problems. As the vice-captain of the Roger Pirates, Rayleigh has many issues to consider. This is a battle between pirates. After seeing Arthur's qualifications with his own eyes, Burndy and others will definitely find an opportunity to kill Arthur. After all, it's better to dispose of such a genius. A genius who can't grow up is just a waste. Rayleigh understands very well that for these situations, one must be vigilant and vigilant, and must not relax in the slightest. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. On the first day of uploading 10 updates started. Sixth update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 7, Wake Up. The changes brought about by the blood of the Red Dragon. Advertisement. War. In the end, it lasted a total of seven hours, and it almost broke up, 
and the two sides ended in a tie. Amount Although it ended in a tie, in fact the Roger Pirates did not continue to pursue, and as time went by, the Ward Pirates had been beaten more or less unbearably, and chose to retreat under such circumstances. Ha ha ha! Carrying Ace on his shoulders, Roger laughed and said, Burndy, you bastard! Next time we meet, you have to hold on longer. Burndy turned around and growled angrily, Roger, you bastard! Momo 100 times the gun. 10 bursts. The angry Burndy directly chose to fire, and the pitch black shells that covered the sky fell directly, which meant to directly destroy the Roger pirates. But. This thing. That's really the case. It's okay to scare the uninitiated. Are you going to scare these guys from the Roger pirates? Isn't that just like a joke? It's just like nonsense. Brush. Brush. Roger cut out a series of slashes casually, cutting everything off. The war is completely over. Humph. Advertisement. The corners of Roger's mouth curled up with a smile, and as the war ended, he turned his head and asked, Rayleigh, are the three brats all right? Rayleigh shook his head and said, Roger, don't worry, they are all resting in the room, nothing happened. But, after the Conqueror's collision, especially Arthur, because of the collision, he awakened his Conqueror's hacky, what is the age it's so small, it takes time to get used to. Um. Roger nodded, but didn't continue to say anything. This is not surprising. Arthur awakened Conqueror's hacky when he was only nine years old. This is indeed a genius, even a monster, but the problem is. Awakening Conqueror's Hacky at such a young age has caused great damage to my body, to put it bluntly. It's just that Arthur is very talented. If he were an ordinary person, even if he had this talent, he would be awakened. It is easy to directly shock yourself and become an idiot, and awaken inappropriate abilities at an inappropriate age. Sometimes, this is not necessarily a good thing. Nobody bothered Arthur. Shanks and Buggy woke up after 10 hours of coma. And Arthur woke up after being in a coma for nearly 15 hours. Um. Familiar ceiling. What? Pain. Arthur slowly opened his eyes, but said something that wasn't right, rubbed his head, feeling the severe pain in his brain, lay on the bed, and murmured, I remember. Um. His head was like a paste. Arthur gradually came back to his senses in the confusion, and murmured, I remember that after undergoing the Conqueror's collision between Captain Roger and Burndy, my Red Dragon bloodline was awakened. Conqueror's hacky, and then. Advertisement. The blood of the Red Dragon. Arthur suddenly reflected, and the whole person hurriedly checked his attribute panel. Name, Arthur Pendragon. Noble Phantasm. The Sword of Promised Victory, 13 Seals Unlocked, The Spear That Shines at the End, Unlocked, Distant Gensikyo, Unlocked. Bloodline, Red Dragon Bloodline, 10%. Island Power, Unawakened. Knights Dash. British Isles. The City of Chalk. Hacky, Conqueror's Hacky, Beginner, Armament Hacky, Beginner, Observation Hacky, Beginner. Just awakened, has the blood of the red dragon reached 10%? And. Because you awakened the blood of the red dragon, you activated Conqueror's Hacky by the way. Arthur was not surprised by this, after all dragons. The giant dragons in mythology all have Longway, and Longway and Conqueror's Hacky seem to be the same thing. Even if I haven't unlocked the skill of Longway, unlocking a Conqueror's Hacky is still not a problem. But, Arthur rubbed his head, sat up, and thought about it, the first time you unlocked it, did it directly reach 10%? It always seems very strange. Indeed. I have not awakened the blood of the red dragon all this time. I thought that the most I had awakened was 1%, but I didn't expect it to increase to 10% in one go. But, bump. 
Advertisement. Bump. Arthur covered his chest with one hand, feeling the violent beating of his heart. It didn't look like a human's beating range at all, it was really like a terrifying beast, no. Wrong. Even more terrifying than ferocious beasts is the beating heart of the dragon. My heart should have been completely remodeled. If. With the awakening of the blood of the red dragon, my body will gradually be transformed. In that case, I will truly become a red dragon. Try it a little bit. Arthur didn't hesitate, and stretched out a hand directly to his abdomen, and pulled out the sword of vowed victory from his abdomen. Um. This can be regarded as a storage magic, it can be regarded as a small cheat that I traveled through, and the sword of vowed victory is stored in it, although it is said. This is the legendary holy sword that has the power to destroy stars, as long as the thirteen seals are unlocked, it can destroy stars. But ah! Uh, Arthur is a seal that has not been broken, and now the sword of the vowed victory is sharp and strong in his hands, and he doesn't even know the Wind King's enchantment, just. It's embarrassing. Of course, Arthur didn't hesitate, took the sword of the vowed victory, and directly pierced his arm. His. The severe pain made Arthur grit his teeth, but he still calmly analyzed, it is obvious that the barrier has increased a lot. It seems that in terms of defense, it has been greatly improved, and. I can feel that my own his physical strength seems to be more abundant. Brush. Pulling out the curry stick in his hand, Arthur looked at his left arm. After about ten minutes, the injury on the entire left arm was completely healed, obviously. These are the improvements brought by the blood of the red dragon. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. On the first day of uploading ten updates started. Seventh more. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 8, Nine Years Old Conquerors. Arthur resounds through the sea. Advertisement. Back and forth. Arthur spent a total of about 30 minutes studying the improvement he had brought to himself after awakening the blood of the red dragon. In general. Improvements in all aspects, physical strength, strength, speed, resilience, defense. It's an improvement in all aspects. With the awakening of the blood of the red dragon, Arthur is also emotional, no wonder. In myths and stories, those who slay dragons have become extremely powerful heroes. This is indeed very strong. Which one is very strong in every aspect? Creek. Pushing open the door, Arthur returned to the deck. Arthur. Arthur. Shanks and Buggy immediately surrounded Arthur when they saw Arthur. Shanks looked at Arthur and asked, Arthur, are you okay? Buggy clasped his arms around his chest, and said with a displeased face, You guy, you actually awakened Conqueror's Hacky? Oof. Just wait, I'm sure I can do it too. But. Are you all right, guy? He he he. Looking at the worried Shanks and the arrogant buggy, Arthur nodded with a light smile and said, Don't worry, I'm fine, it's just that I'm a little tired because I awakened Conqueror's Hacky, it's not a big problem. Snapped. Advertisement. Snapped. Roger, Rayleigh, Jabba, San Bell, and others all walked over, and Jabba asked with a smile, Arthur, little guy. How do you feel? Feel it? Arthur clenched his fist slightly, and then said, Mr. Jabba, it sounds amazing. This is a special power. Buzz. Talking. An astonishing wave of air burst out from Arthur's body, of course. Compared with the almost substantive conqueror's hacky of Roger and Burndy, what Arthur showed was an invisible sense of oppression. So. The gap is still huge. 
Arthur doesn't think so, he is only nine years old, and he still needs time to grow up, this is not a strange thing, no matter at any time, growth is a step by step, how can he eat himself into a fat man of... Isn't that exhausting? Ha ha ha. Roger laughed grinningly, Arthur. Arthur. You're also called Conqueror's Hacky? It's a shame. Listening to Captain Roger's words, Arthur just looked at Rayleigh silently and said, Mr. Rayleigh, do you have anything to say? Roger's smile stopped abruptly, and his whole face was the color of a pig's liver. This is Roger. Just like Luffy, he's just like a joke in normal times, and he can only be serious when he needs to be serious. Rayleigh didn't care, and said with a smile, Arthur, try to use Conqueror's hacky as little as possible. For you, you are still too young. Using Conqueror's hacky too forcefully is not good for your health, but... Awakened Conqueror's hacky at such a young age, it is also very important for the next improvement. Um. Um. Advertisement. Arthur nodded earnestly, although he has the blood of the three no ones, and perfectly inherited the template of King Arthur, but... Captain Roger, Mr. Rayleigh, Mr. Jabba, and others have all sailed on the sea for decades. Each of them has a wealth of experience, Captain Roger and Mr. Jabba are two ordinary people, but Mr. Rayleigh is perfect in all aspects, capable of writing and martial arts, and is also a good teacher of apprentices. Even though... Some people always joke that the fake teacher Rayleigh and the real teacher Kaido. But ah! Uh, this is just a joke. If there is no firm foundation laid by Rayleigh for Luffy, even if Luffy is the protagonist, it is impossible to casually hang up. But... Rayleigh seemed to have thought of something, pushed his glasses, and said, Arthur, although only we and the ward pirates know about this matter, but... The sea always spreads the fastest. If there is an accident, in a short time, you will resound through the sea. Only. It's not a good thing. Rayleigh shook his head with emotion, a great reputation is a good thing, but it is not a good thing, it is the same for anyone, under this huge pressure, can Arthur handle it? This is also a problem. Arthur smiled and nodded, Mr. Rayleigh, I see. Rayleigh didn't say much either, Arthur had always been a child like an adult, very mature and steady, he knew what to do. The Roger pirates regained their calm, doing what they usually do one by one. Cultivate what should be practiced, and what should be committed should be committed. And. For this sea, it is completely different. With the departure of the ward pirates, Arthur's name has spread to the entire sea. Arthur Pendragon. Gee ha 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 ha. Golden Lion Shiki, one of the three legendary pirates, laughed a lot when he heard the news, the kid who awakened Conqueror's Haki at the age of nine. Interesting. It seems that the war against the Roger Pirates, it's going to be faster. It's not quite there yet, but Shiki is already planning for the 8 Vol naval battle. Goo la la la. Funny kid. Whitebeard Newgate, one of the three legendary pirates, was also laughing boldly at this moment, and he said interestingly, this world. Sure enough, it is getting more and more interesting. Every funny kid, bullet that kid, and Arthur kid on Roger's boat. But. Newgate just said a few words casually. He was not very interested. For him, the only thing he valued most was his family. Besides. Everything else is not important. As predicted. As Rayleigh said, within a short period of time, Arthur's reputation almost resounded throughout the world, White Beard, Golden Lion, Big Mom, Wong Beard, John, Silver Axe, GP, Green Pepper, Burndy, Baloric. It even includes Marine. And many more. Everyone already knows. P.S. Zio King's new book is uploaded. On the first day of uploading 10 updates started. 8th. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. 
Gaikyo Evaluation Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate Recharge, Activity Time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement Chapter 9, Warship Attacks Old Mad Dog Garb Advertisement Arthur Pendragon Ha 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 Standing on the bow of the warship, the burly man folded his arms around his chest, with a ferocious smile on the corner of his mouth, and said cruelly, Exactly. Such a dangerous brat, let's deal with it with the Roger Pirates. Bar. Attack. Yes. Vice Admiral Garp. With a loud roar, the warship headed straight into the distance at an extremely fast speed. Huh. Arthur let out a foul breath, put down the ape, and then thought about it, the recovery of the body is faster, and the strength is also stronger. This being ape is no longer suitable. Arthur. What's wrong? The boxer with spiked hairstyle and spiked boxing gloves also took off his gloves, wiped the sweat from his forehead, looked at Arthur, and asked strangely. Arthur shook his head and said, the strength has been improved these days, this heavy sword is a bit inappropriate. What? I Dragon was stunned, but he knew that the ape in Arthur's hand had only been replaced for seven months. Besides, isn't Arthur's progress in cultivation too fast? What's wrong? Bankuro, who was very small and had an explosive head, also came over. After listening to the explanation of the eye dragon, he was also shocked and said, Arthur, your ape is not easy to use again. Arthur nodded and said, it can still be used barely, but it can't keep up with the increase in strength. It's best to replace it. Advertisement. Ah this. Both Yanlong and Bankuro are a little confused. Is this progress too fast? But? This matter is not a big deal, but it is still very important. Rayleigh walked over and said, Arthur, when we arrive at the next island next time, I will prepare a new ape for you. Arthur nodded and thanked, Mr. Rayleigh, thank you. Fine. Brush. Before Rayleigh finished speaking, he turned around suddenly, the long knife on his waist was unsheathed instantly, a cold light flashed, and the galloping shells were instantly separated. Boom. Next moment. The shells exploded directly on both sides, while Rayleigh squinted his eyes slightly, watching the warships gradually emerging in the distance, and said seriously, everyone. Get ready for battle, Marine is here. What? It's that old mad dog again. What a hassle. The people of the Roger Pirates were immediately ready for battle, but? None of them looked particularly good looking. Monkey D. Garp. Arthur also whispered softly, the vice admiral of the distant warship is Garp, that is, the father of the dragon in the original book, and the grandfather of Luffy. The family occupies the three paths of Marine, Revolutionary Army, and Pirates, and they are all leaders. Of course. Arthur was really no stranger to Garp. In the past eight years, Garp has really caught up every day, in terms of frequency. About once a month, that's more punctual than the ants visit, basically once a month, if you find the traces of the Roger Pirates, you will kill them. Advertisement this matter. Hmm. In fact, it dates back to the Valley of the Gods War, when Garp and Roger teamed up to defeat that monster, the terrifying monster that ruled New World for decades, Rox D. Zebek. As for the strength of this monster, of course, there is no need to say much. After defeating this monster, Roger became one of the three legendary pirates, and Garp became the hero of naval headquarters. Ken. For Garp, he saw that Roger was very dangerous, so. If you choose to pursue Roger, you must capture Roger and send him to Impel Down. Ha ha ha. Roger walked over with a grin, the corners of his mouth curled up, and he said with a smile, Garp. You old mad dog, are you here again? Ha ha ha. 
In response to Roger, Garp laughed the same way, and said proudly, Roger. You bastard, today Lao Z must personally arrest you and send you to impel down. Yes. The corner of Roger's mouth curled up, and he said confidently, let's wait until you succeed. Humph. Correct. Garp raised the corner of his mouth, and suddenly looked around, scanning the entire Roger pirate group, and said, Arthur Pendragon, who is this brat, stand up. Um. Everyone in the Roger Pirates was stunned and looked at Arthur in unison. Arthur was also stunned and shook his head, saying that he didn't know Garp at all. Shanks and Buggy looked at Arthur strangely, and Buggy said even more strangely, Arthur, you don't have an illegitimate relationship with Garp, do you? I heard about it. Back then. Bump. Advertisement. Arthur punched Buggy's stomach without hesitation, and in an instant, Buggy turned into a boiled prawn writhing on the ground. Arthur came out step by step and stood beside Roger. Snapped. Snapped. Roger patted Arthur on the shoulder, grinned, and said confidently, Boy Arthur, don't be afraid. You are a member of our Roger Pirates, no matter what time it is, you don't need to be afraid of anyone. Captain Roger. I see. A smile appeared on Arthur's face, then he looked up, looked directly at Garp, and asked with a smile, Vice Admiral Garp, what can I do for you? Ha ha ha. Garp laughed boldly and said, you are the one who awakened the Conqueror's hacky at the age of nine? You have a good spirit. But, kid, you will be arrested by me today with Roger, and you will be arrested like Impel Down. Crackling. Clenching his fists with both hands, Garp moved his muscles and bones slightly, and his whole breath became different. Search. Search. Next moment. Garp directly grabbed the two cannonballs beside him, and threw them directly at Arthur. The speed was extremely fast, and the speed was like an afterimage, and it fell directly at Arthur. And this scene caused Arthur's eyes to shrink in an instant, from the emerald green pupils like blue waves to red dragon pupils, and almost instinctively drew out the sword of vowed victory. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. On the first day of uploading 10 updates started. Ninth update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 10, The Battle Begins. Arthur vs. Jun. Advertisement. Brush. Brush. Boom. The sharp sword light slashed across, Arthur's offensive was fast enough, the sword of vowed victory in his hand crossed the beautiful sword flower, the two cannonballs were instantly cut into four pieces, crossed the Roger pirates, and exploded behind him instantly, the sparks of the explosion spread to the surroundings. Huh. Slightly exhaling, Arthur smiled, but did not speak, but secretly said in his heart, sure enough. A monster like Captain Roger is really scary. It's just two shells thrown out at random, almost I can't take it anymore. Strength. Speed. When the two are combined, even without any fancy tricks, even without armament hacky attached, but still destroying those weaker than himself, Arthur could slice through Garp's two shells with the sharpness of the sword sworn to victory. To be honest. This is a trick. Ha ha ha. Looking at this scene, Roger laughed boldly and said, Hey. Hey. Garp, you old mad dog is really embarrassing. Don't you just have such a little strength? Now even a trainee from our Roger pirates are all the thieves' opponents. Humph. Garp grinned, and said ferociously, Whether I am the opponent of this kid, I don't know, but... It is not a problem to arrest you Roger. Advertisement. Yes. 
of course. Fistbone meteorite. God avoids. The two shot at the same time, and with the shots of Roger and Garp, the battle began in an instant. Unlike ordinary pirates who chose to retreat in the face of Marine, the Roger pirate group was not afraid at all. Instead, they directly chose to take the initiative to meet them. Naturally, ordinary pirate ships are no match for Marine's warships, but... The Oro Jackson of the Roger Pirates was built by Tom the Murloc, the world's number one shipbuilder, using the treasure tree atom. Boom. Boom. The roar of artillery fire resounded, and the two sides had already started fighting again. With the roar of artillery fire, one round of bullets passed by, one after another of shells fell, and as they got closer, the people on both sides also started hand-to-hand -hand combat. Both Shanks and Buggy have joined the battlefield, but... It's enough for someone to watch, otherwise, if the two little guys have an accident, it will be very troublesome. Do you think it's weird? The strength of the Roger Pirates, and the warship led by Garp, other than Garp, can anyone else compare to the Cotters of the Roger Pirates? Actually. Yes, Garp is leading the elite among the elite. Although many of them are not high in military rank, they all have the strength of Vice Admiral, and there are many supernovas in Marine, not only that. There are also a large number of Marine elites. Because of this, Garp was able to chase after Roger's pirates. Otherwise, if Garp was really the only one, even though Roger and Garp were friends and foes, but they really seized the opportunity, that would be without any hesitation, Garp will definitely be slaughtered. Brush. Advertisement. Crackling. Arthur is no exception. He also joined the battlefield with the Sword of the Oath of Victory. Haki and Kendo are very good in Arthur's hands. Ordinary Marine soldiers, even ordinary generals, are not Arthur's opponents. Rabbit cut. But at this moment, a cold light galloped past, and the crisp female voice just entered the ears, and the next moment, it was followed by an extremely fast slash. Brush brush. This speed was really too fast, like after images, it fell directly at Arthur, and the sharp slash did not mean to be merciless, on the contrary, it was completely rushing to kill. Um. Arthur turned around suddenly, and almost instinctively raised the curry stick in his hand in a very weird posture. Jingle. In this way, he blocked the opponent's attack, and Arthur felt the opponent's slender but incomparably huge strength, and secretly said, Woman, who is it? And. Is this the super straight feeling brought by the blood of the red dragon? Intuition. In other words, it would be more appropriate to call it the sixth sense. King Arthur himself has a super intuition, and the manifestation of intuition is also very simple. In battle, in daily life, or in a sneak attack, you will instinctively perceive danger. And if it is the most intuitive feeling like bug, that must be the super intuitiveness of Von Gola family. That is really the same as bug, which makes people feel too outrageous. Jingle. Crackling. Advertisement. Arthur and the attacking Marine, the two fought quickly, and the two weapons quickly streaked across streams of light. After that, the two took a step back at the same time, and this was the separation. Huh. Arthur let out a bad breath, and this is the one who looked at the person opposite him seriously. The first thing that catches his eyes must be the long legs, especially the spider tattoo, which makes people feel intoxicated, and the jet black hair, and the beauty mole on the corner of her lips, paired with a pink dress, has already proved her identity. Momuzagi Jun. Certainly. Compared with Admiral, who will be naval headquarters alternate in the future, Jun has not yet won the title of Momuzagi. Her identity is only a seaman first class. Although her strength is good, she is only a 14-year-old marine supernova. Even if she is adopted as a crane and treated as a younger sister, in marine, she can only grow step by step, and it is impossible to reach the sky in one step. 
Arthur Pendragon. Jun clenched the long knife in his hand, and said very seriously, in the name of absolute justice, I will arrest you. Facing Jun, Arthur still smiled and said, since that's the case. Then come and see if you can arrest me. Snapped. Both of them clenched the weapons in their hands, narrowed their eyes slightly, and stared at each other. One was King Arthur who had awakened Conqueror's Haki at the age of nine and had the blood of the Red Dragon, and the other was Admiral, the future Marine candidate. The current Marine Supernova. P.S. Zio King's new book is uploaded. On the first day of uploading ten updates started. The tenth update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo Evaluation P.S. The first day of Zioking's 10th update is over. Brothers, beg for flowers, monthly tickets, rewards, and comments. Add more. Add more. Add more. Celebrate the 7-day long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time. October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 11, Kendo. Gymnastics. Hacking. Suppression in every way. Advertisement. Jingle. Crackling. Arthur and Jun, the two quickly intertwined. One is only 9 years old. One is only 14 years old. Even if you are young. Ken. The strength they displayed shocked many elites. Rabbit leap. Jun's eyes contracted, and his whole body was like an extremely fast rabbit, a stream of light flashed across it in an instant, heading straight for Arthur's throat. Snapped. Take a step back, but... This is not to retreat, but to retreat. The curry stick in Arthur's hand has found the flaw in this move in an instant, and he stabs out with a sword. It is a very simple sword, but it is such an understatement. Jun can only choose to back down. Damn it! Jun turned around in mid-air and landed on the ground. His exquisite face was very unattractive. Although it was only a blow, he knew that his kendo was seen through. The opponent's eyes were very vicious, and he directly saw through him. With all the skills, this sword pierced through the flaws, making him have to retreat brush. Shaking the curry stick in his hand, Arthur stroked the sword of vowed victory with one hand, and continued, do you want to continue? Humph. Rabbit cut. Advertisement. Jun didn't answer, but shot again. It was still a very fast offensive. Jun's future title is worthy of Momuzagi. The way of attacking is really like a rabbit, launching a swift and fierce offensive at an extremely fast speed. Crackling. Only. Arthur suppressed Jun perfectly. Although he couldn't kill Jun, he suppressed Jun perfectly in every aspect. Seeing this aspect, Jun was no match at all. No way. There are other people watching around, Jun is an outstanding supernova of Marine, how could no one be watching, ugh. Of course, the main reason was that Arthur could suppress Jun, but he couldn't kill him. Don't think that Jun is weak. Although the 14-year-old Jun is seaman first class, it does not mean that he is weak. What does alternate admiral mean? The strength of the owner admiral, but the prestige, reputation, and other aspects are still not enough. As for Yuxiao and Huang Mio? Um. These two are rather special. The world's big conscription, this is the position they should have. Far away. Ha. Ha. Jun panted slightly, she looked at Arthur deeply, full of endless reluctance, she was no match at all. In every aspect, I am the one being suppressed, no matter how I look at it, I am not at the same level. Hateful. Jun clenched his teeth, his heart filled with resentment. She is also the proud child of heaven, but at this moment, facing a boy who is five years younger than herself, is she not an opponent? Kendo. 
In terms of kendo, no matter how fast and exquisite his own kendo was, Arthur could block his own attack with just one blow. Gymnastics. It's not at the same level at all. Although Arthur is young, his physical fitness is like a monster. Advertisement. Hacky. Arthur's control of Conqueror's Hacky is very proficient, including Conqueror's Hacky, which makes people feel like a person who has just awakened Conqueror's Hacky not long ago. Every aspect is suppressed. But. It's not a bad thing. A Marine Vice Admiral, who was hiding in the dark to protect Jun, shook his head slightly, nodded again, and said secretly, Failure is a good thing for a proud man of heaven, otherwise. Climb to the top step by step, when you are defeated halfway up the mountain, it will be even more troublesome. If you are defeated at the foot of the mountain, you just need to keep a humble heart and continue to go up step by step, but when you are defeated in the middle of the mountain, you will be neither up nor down, and your mentality will collapse. Then everything is over. Therefore, the failure this time was actually not a bad thing for Jun. Ha ha ha. Roger also paid attention to this side, and laughed loudly, Hey. Hey. Old mad dog, you are no match at all. This is the genius of your marine. Compared with my little Arthur, he is nothing at all. This moment. Roger's tone was completely like, Look at how powerful my little one is. He he he. Garp grinned, and said ferociously, Roger, our battle has nothing to do with the juniors, you should take care of yourself. Come. Who is afraid of whom? Fistbone meteorite. God avoids. Advertisement. The two played against each other again. As old opponents, they were very familiar with each other, and it was almost impossible to tell the winner in a short time. The other side. Facing Arthur's comprehensive suppression in every aspect, Jun did not flinch, but stood in front of Arthur with a more determined attitude, this time with the attitude of a challenger. Continue. Jun looked at Arthur who did not take the initiative to attack, but said sharply, Today. I will definitely defeat you. It is good. It is good. Arthur just nodded with a smile and said, Then, come and beat me. Brush. Stretching the curry stick in his hand, Arthur's containment slowly retracted, his whole expression became serious, not full of jokes, but extremely serious, next, it's the real battle. Snapped. With one foot on the ground, Arthur was extremely fast, like an afterimage, holding a curry stick, and launched an attack in an instant. Is the way of the sword very subtle? Indeed. Arthur inherited the template of King Arthur. Of course. I also inherited many skills, inheritance and combat experience from King Arthur. All in all, as long as I activate the blood of the Red Dragon, all of these can be mastered by myself. My kendo combines Rayleigh's teachings, my own research and the legacy of King Arthur. Under the triple level, the improvement brought about is the greatest. I have embarked on a brand new path of swordsmanship. Although it is only in its infancy, it has already taken shape. P.S. Zio King's new book is uploaded. On the first day of uploading 10 updates started. 11th update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. P.S. Brothers. No more nonsense. 3000 flowers update and more. Brothers, work hard, voted 6000 flowers in one breath, there will be a chapter to add more later. On the first day, there will be at least 12 explosive updates. Brothers, beg for support. Celebrate the 7 day long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 12, Jun's Extra Plan. Defeat 2 with 1 against 2. Advertisement. Rabbit Cut. 
Soil thorn. At the moment when Jun shot, at the same time, the ground suddenly began to twist, and soil thorns appeared on the ground where there was no soil. You know, this is the deck of a marine warship. Um. Frowning slightly, Arthur backed away quickly, while raising the curry stick to block Jun's attack. Crackling. Quickly dodging the attack, Arthur raised his hand at the same time, two slashes fell immediately, and fell along with the slashes, and a figure was chopped into pieces at the same time. Only. The figure turned into dust and fell to the ground, but recovered quickly. Logia. Earthen fruit. Arthur recognized the ability of this devil fruit at a glance. Although it had never appeared in the original book, he knew that this was a real world, and it couldn't be just a scene shown in that story. Earthy fruit. As one of the Logia devil fruits, the body structure is transformed into soil. If it is on the earth, it is definitely the most terrifying devil fruit, but it is now on the sea. Jun. I'm afraid you are no match for him yourself. Shall we join forces? A young but wretched looking person came out, and he looked at Jun very seriously. Advertisement. Naval Headquarters, Seaman First Class, plus, 15 years old. Also one of the supernovas at Naval Headquarters. It is good. Jun also nodded, she knew that only because she was definitely not Arthur's opponent, only by joining forces with Kaji, could the two join hands to defeat Arthur. Are the two working together? It doesn't matter. Arthur was very calm, he didn't care whether his opponent was two or one, he just kept going forward. Forever. Inheriting Arthur's self, then he must show the corresponding boldness. Earn. Jun clenched the long knife in his hand, and Cake's hands turned into dust. The two stared at Arthur and shot at the same time. Rabbit leap. Jun took the lead, and a sharp knife fell, and at the same time, streaks of dust streaked across the ground. Earth crossing. Pressing his hands hard on the deck, a series of earth thorns burst out instantly, wrapped around armament hacky respectively, and emerged from all directions, intending to kill Arthur directly here. Huh. Slightly exhaling foul breath, Arthur narrowed his eyes slightly, the next moment. The terrifying breath burst out. Roar. Faintly and faintly, there seemed to be a roaring sound from Arthur's body. Brush. Brush. Advertisement. The curry stick in his hand flashed extremely fast, and Arthur tore apart everything in front of him at a speed visible to the naked eye. Facing Arthur's blow, Jun could only retreat quickly and continue moving forward, I'm afraid I can't bear it either. Snapped. Click. Arthur stepped on the ground with one foot, and the deck collapsed in an instant, but the whole person went straight to the two people in front of him like a cannonball. The speed was too fast, like an afterimage. Make both Jun and Cake shrink their eyes at the same time. Not good. Hateful. Bump. An astonishing force fell on the two of them. Although the two blocked Arthur's attack at the very moment, they also felt the huge pressure. The powerful force directly knocked the two of them away like cannonballs. Installed on the surrounding decks, two deep pits were directly smashed out. Arthur. Are you okay? Hey. Shanks and Buggy also ran over quickly, and the two saw Arthur's exhibition of Kamui, but the problem is. Arthur wouldn't have any surprises in such a fight, would he? As the smoke rose and gradually dissipated, Arthur's figure emerged, looked at the two people who were running fast, and smiled, Shanks, Buggy, I'm fine, the two of them are not my opponents. Arthur, who said this, was full of absolute confidence. He was clearly the two supernovas of Marine, but in Arthur's mouth, it seemed that it was not worth mentioning. That's good. The two of them also breathed a sigh of relief, as long as it's okay, Arthur state just now, anyone who is not an idiot can tell that Arthur must have used some special skills. Asshole. Hateful. At this moment, following the sound, 
Jun and Cake rushed out again at the same time. Advertisement. Only. Shanks blocked Jun's attack with a knife, while Buggy slashed across with two knives, directly cutting off the soil thorns used by Cake. Snapped. Arthur patted the shoulders of the two with both hands, but said seriously, Shanks, Buggy, this is my opponent, and I will never lose. Shanks took a step back and said seriously, No problem, Arthur. Buggy said arrogantly, Arthur, before you lose to me, why don't you lose to others? He he he. Arthur smiled, held a curry stick, looked at the two, and said seriously, Next. Then it's the second stage of the battle. Humph. The faces of Jun and Cake were both ugly, and they teamed up, but they were beaten by Arthur? He was also directly sent flying. How can this be accepted? They are also proud marine supernovas. Arthur didn't care what the two of them were thinking, the aura on his body became terrifying again just like before, and the crimson dragon eyes appeared again, and this time, every inch of Arthur's body seemed to be faintly flickering. The red light is very faint, and it is basically impossible to find it without careful inspection. Snapped. The next moment, with one foot on the ground, Arthur was extremely fast, with a curry stick in his hand, like a raging dragon, he had already rushed towards the two of them, one against two. The two future alternates admiral? Not worth mentioning. Arthur would win and beat them both. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. On the first day of uploading 10 updates started. 12th update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. P.S. Brothers. The 12th update on the first day. 6,000 flowers plus more. There are still 2,200 flowers to continue to add more. Whether there are more updates depends on the support of the brothers. Ask for a wave of support. Start it. Start it. Start it. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 13, The Curtain Ends. Three Months. Progress. Advertisement. Jun. Plus. Both of them had already fallen to the ground, their faces were pale, and they had gradually lost consciousness. Although they were not dead, they were indeed defeated. Compared to the two of them, Arthur was gasping heavily outside, it seems that nothing has changed. Huh. Breathing out a deep breath, Arthur wiped the sweat from his forehead, and said secretly, the body can't bear it, no. To be precise, it is only my current body that can fully release the power of the Red Dragon's blood. It still hasn't been remodeled. Bloodline of the Red Dragon. It is not a certain ability, it is simply wrong to say that it uses a certain power in an explosive manner. Exactly. Arthur's blood of the Red Dragon means that he turned into a humanoid dragon, just. The awakening time of the Red Dragon's blood was too short, and his body was not perfect enough. Just now, he forcibly stimulated the blood. Um. It's a bit overconsumed, and that's probably what it means. Ha ha ha. While Arthur was still thinking about it, Roger laughed and said, Shame. Shame. Is this the strength of Marine? It's not worth mentioning. What Marine Supernova is nothing compared to our kid worth mentioning. Brothers. Retreat. Oh who? The people of the Roger Pirates began to retreat in an orderly manner, and their movements were very skilled. Advertisement. Um. After so many years, I have already been proficient. I have been tracked by Garp again and again for so many years, fighting and retreating. I am really proficient and very familiar with all aspects. There is really no problem. One by one quickly retreated, and Arthur, Shanks, 
and Buggy also returned to the ship, and then, after a series of familiar but useless actions such as retreat, pursuit, and shelling, the Roger Pirates retreated completely. Seriously. If the Roger Pirates wanted to leave at the beginning, they would have left long ago. There is no need to start a war. Except for Roger to fight with Garp, the more important thing is to let everyone see how strong my little devil is. Much better than any supernova in your marine. This battle. The curtain fell like this, and Garp shook his head when he looked at the two little ghosts who passed out, well. It's not a bad thing. For these two little ghosts, let them wake up and know that they are not invincible. Good thing. People. It's better to accept setbacks earlier, otherwise, when you grow to a certain height, if you can't hold on to the setbacks, then there will really be problems. Now accept the setbacks earlier, although you will lose for a while, as long as you come out, then the future will be an indomitable progress. But. Arthur Pendragon. Brat. I remember you. Garp squinted his eyes. For this outstanding little ghost, he had already remembered it. It is not a good thing for such a little ghost to appear among the pirates. If there is a chance, it is best to deal with it quickly. Best result. Out of Garp's pursuit. Advertisement. Um. This matter has come to an end, and after this battle, Arthur not only does not have any complacency, on the contrary, it is just the opposite. Arthur felt even more that his strength was not qualified enough. Jun. Plus. Not to mention the strength of the two of them, but after awakening the blood of the Red Dragon, it is impossible to accept all the improvements brought by the blood of the Red Dragon. This is absolutely impossible. Arthur started continuous high-intensity training, and Shanks and Buggy were also very dissatisfied with themselves, what a shame. Looking at Arthur, looking at himself? Under such circumstances, the two little guys also started high-intensity training. The three little guys are training hard every day, and Rayleigh is also teaching daily. And. Such days lasted for three months. During these three months, Garp came to visit him regularly every month, which was really much more frequent than that of his aunt. However, during these three months, he also met the Babeo Saijun by chance, there was a little fight. Speak up. This probability is also quite low. After all, it is quite interesting to meet by chance on this huge sea. But. For Arthur, these three months have been very hard, he has been training seriously, and he has honed himself very seriously every day. Tick. Advertisement. Tick. Drops of sweat dripped from his forehead, Arthur's small face looked very pale, but he swung the even bigger ape without any pause, every movement was very standard, where to stop, and then lift it up again. And the more so, the more tired he was. What's more, Arthur was still carrying a load on his body. This kind of training, even Shanks, the future four emperors, a real monster, couldn't do it. It is that Arthur's red dragon blood has begun to be fully stimulated, and his resilience is also like that of a red dragon. This is how he can persevere. Huh. Breathing out a deep breath, Arthur finished the training, put down the ape in his hand, wiped the sweat from his forehead, and murmured, I can feel that the blood of the red dragon at this stage has begun to fully exert itself. Only. But. Without waiting for Arthur to think more, Shanks came over and said, Arthur, it's time for dinner. And, you have to pay attention, if this kind of training causes harm to the body, it will be very troublesome. Yes. Yes. Buggy also agreed, Arthur, I haven't defeated you yet, you don't want to lose now. Arthur suppressed the thoughts in his heart, looked at the two, and said with a smile, Don't worry, I won't have any accidents, let's go, go to dinner, and then I should have a good rest. Um. Both of them nodded, and the three of them walked towards the restaurant, ready to finish their meal. P.S., 
Zio King's new book is uploaded. Every day 5 changes. The first update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the 7 day long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 13, The Curtain Ends. 3 Months. Progress. Advertisement. Jun. Plus. Both of them had already fallen to the ground, their faces were pale, and they had gradually lost consciousness. Although they were not dead, they were indeed defeated. Compared to the two of them, Arthur was gasping heavily outside, it seems that nothing has changed. Huh. Breathing out a deep breath, Arthur wiped the sweat from his forehead, and said secretly, the body can't bear it, no. To be precise, it is only my current body that can fully release the power of the Red Dragon's blood. It still hasn't been remodeled. Bloodline of the Red Dragon. It is not a certain ability, it is simply wrong to say that it uses a certain power in an explosive manner. Exactly. Arthur's blood of the Red Dragon means that he turned into a humanoid dragon, just. The awakening time of the Red Dragon's blood was too short, and his body was not perfect enough. Just now, he forcibly stimulated the blood. Um. It's a bit overconsumed, and that's probably what it means. Ha ha ha. While Arthur was still thinking about it, Roger laughed and said, Shame. Shame. Is this the strength of Marine? It's not worth mentioning. What Marine Supernova is nothing compared to our kid worth mentioning. Brothers. Retreat. Oh who? The people of the Roger Pirates began to retreat in an orderly manner, and their movements were very skilled. Advertisement. Um. After so many years, I have already been proficient. I have been tracked by Garp again and again for so many years, fighting and retreating. I am really proficient and very familiar with all aspects. There is really no problem. One by one quickly retreated, and Arthur, Shanks, and Buggy also returned to the ship, and then, after a series of familiar but useless actions such as retreat, pursuit, and shelling, the Roger Pirates retreated completely. Seriously. If the Roger Pirates wanted to leave at the beginning, they would have left long ago. There is no need to start a war. Except for Roger to fight with Garp, the more important thing is to let everyone see how strong my little devil is. Much better than any supernova in your marine. This battle. The curtain fell like this, and Garp shook his head when he looked at the two little ghosts who passed out, well. It's not a bad thing. For these two little ghosts, let them wake up and know that they are not invincible. Good thing. People. It's better to accept setbacks earlier, otherwise, when you grow to a certain height, if you can't hold on to the setbacks, then there will really be problems. Now accept the setbacks earlier, although you will lose for a while, as long as you come out, then the future will be an indomitable progress. But. Arthur Pendragon. Brat. I remember you. Garp squinted his eyes. For this outstanding little ghost, he had already remembered it. It is not a good thing for such a little ghost to appear among the pirates. If there is a chance, it is best to deal with it quickly. Best result. Out of Garp's pursuit. Advertisement. Um. This matter has come to an end, and after this battle, Arthur not only does not have any complacency, on the contrary, it is just the opposite. Arthur felt even more that his strength was not qualified enough. Jun. Plus. Not to mention the strength of the two of them, but after awakening the blood of the Red Dragon, it is impossible to accept all the improvements brought by the blood of the Red Dragon. This is absolutely impossible. 
Arthur started continuous high-intensity training and Shanks and Buggy were also very dissatisfied with themselves, what a shame. Looking at Arthur, looking at himself? Under such circumstances, the two little guys also started high-intensity training. The three little guys are training hard every day, and Rayleigh is also teaching daily. And such days lasted for three months. During these three months, Garp came to visit him regularly every month, which was really much more frequent than that of his aunt. However, during these three months, he also met the Babao Saijun by chance, there was a little fight. Speak up. This probability is also quite low. After all, it is quite interesting to meet by chance on this huge sea. But, for Arthur, these three months have been very hard, he has been training seriously, and he has honed himself very seriously every day. Tick. Advertisement. Tick. Drops of sweat dripped from his forehead, Arthur's small face looked very pale, but he swung the even bigger epee without any pause, every movement was very standard, where to stop, and then lift it up again. And the more so, the more tired he was. What's more, Arthur was still carrying a load on his body. This kind of training, even Shanks, the future four emperors, a real monster, couldn't do it. It is that Arthur's red dragon blood has begun to be fully stimulated, and his resilience is also like that of a red dragon. This is how he can persevere. Huh. Breathing out a deep breath, Arthur finished the training, put down the epee in his hand, wiped the sweat from his forehead, and murmured, I can feel that the blood of the red dragon at this stage has begun to fully exert itself. Only. But. Without waiting for Arthur to think more, Shanks came over and said, Arthur, it's time for dinner. And, you have to pay attention, if this kind of training causes harm to the body, it will be very troublesome. Yes. Yes. Buggy also agreed, Arthur, I haven't defeated you yet, you don't want to lose now. Arthur suppressed the thoughts in his heart, looked at the two, and said with a smile, don't worry, I won't have any accidents, let's go, go to dinner, and then I should have a good rest. Um. Both of them nodded, and the three of them walked towards the restaurant, ready to finish their meal. P.S. Zio King's new book is uploaded. Every day five changes. The first update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 13, The Curtain Ends. Three Months. Progress. Advertisement. Jun. Plus. Both of them had already fallen to the ground, their faces were pale, and they had gradually lost consciousness. Although they were not dead, they were indeed defeated. Compared to the two of them, Arthur was gasping heavily outside, it seems that nothing has changed. Huh. Breathing out a deep breath, Arthur wiped the sweat from his forehead, and said secretly, the body can't bear it, no. To be precise, it is only my current body that can fully release the power of the Red Dragon's blood. It still hasn't been remodeled. Bloodline of the Red Dragon. It is not a certain ability, it is simply wrong to say that it uses a certain power in an explosive manner. Exactly. Arthur's blood of the Red Dragon means that he turned into a humanoid dragon, just. The awakening time of the Red Dragon's blood was too short, and his body was not perfect enough. Just now, he forcibly stimulated the blood. Um. It's a bit overconsumed, and that's probably what it means. Ha ha ha. While Arthur was still thinking about it, Roger laughed and said, Shame. Shame. Is this the strength of Marine? It's not worth mentioning. What Marine Supernova is nothing compared to our kid worth mentioning. 
Brothers. Retreat. Oh who? The people of the Roger Pirates began to retreat in an orderly manner, and their movements were very skilled. Advertisement. Um. After so many years, I have already been proficient. I have been tracked by Garp again and again for so many years, fighting and retreating. I am really proficient and very familiar with all aspects. There is really no problem. One by one quickly retreated, and Arthur, Shanks, and Buggy also returned to the ship, and then, after a series of familiar but useless actions such as retreat, pursuit, and shelling, the Roger Pirates retreated completely. Seriously. If the Roger Pirates wanted to leave at the beginning, they would have left long ago. There is no need to start a war. Except for Roger to fight with Garp, the more important thing is to let everyone see how strong my little devil is. Much better than any supernova in your marine. This battle. The curtain fell like this, and Garp shook his head when he looked at the two little ghosts who passed out, well. It's not a bad thing. For these two little ghosts, let them wake up and know that they are not invincible. Good thing. People. It's better to accept setbacks earlier, otherwise, when you grow to a certain height, if you can't hold on to the setbacks, then there will really be problems. Now accept the setbacks earlier, although you will lose for a while, as long as you come out, then the future will be an indomitable progress. But. Arthur Pendragon. Brat. I remember you. Garp squinted his eyes. For this outstanding little ghost, he had already remembered it. It is not a good thing for such a little ghost to appear among the pirates. If there is a chance, it is best to deal with it quickly. Best result. Out of Garp's pursuit. Advertisement. Um. This matter has come to an end, and after this battle, Arthur not only does not have any complacency, on the contrary, it is just the opposite. Arthur felt even more that his strength was not qualified enough. Jun. Plus. Not to mention the strength of the two of them, but after awakening the blood of the Red Dragon, it is impossible to accept all the improvements brought by the blood of the Red Dragon. This is absolutely impossible. Arthur started continuous high-intensity training, and Shanks and Buggy were also very dissatisfied with themselves, what a shame. Looking at Arthur, looking at himself? Under such circumstances, the two little guys also started high-intensity training. The three little guys are training hard every day, and Rayleigh is also teaching daily. And. Such days lasted for three months. During these three months, Garp came to visit him regularly every month, which was really much more frequent than that of his aunt. However, during these three months, he also met the Babeo Saijun by chance, there was a little fight. Speak up. This probability is also quite low. After all, it is quite interesting to meet by chance on this huge sea. But. For Arthur, these three months have been very hard, he has been training seriously, and he has honed himself very seriously every day. Tick. Advertisement. Tick. Drops of sweat dripped from his forehead, Arthur's small face looked very pale, but he swung the even vigor pay without any pause, every movement was very standard, where to stop, and then lift it up again. And the more so, the more tired he was. What's more, Arthur was still carrying a load on his body. This kind of training, even Shanks, the future four emperors, a real monster, couldn't do it. It is that Arthur's red dragon blood has begun to be fully stimulated, and his resilience is also like that of a red dragon. This is how he can persevere. Huh. Breathing out a deep breath, Arthur finished the training, put down the apé in his hand, wiped the sweat from his forehead, and murmured, I can feel that the blood of the red dragon at this stage has begun to fully exert itself. Only. But. Without waiting for Arthur to think more, Shanks came over and said, Arthur, it's time for dinner. And, you have to pay attention, if this kind of training causes harm to the body, 
it will be very troublesome. Yes. Yes. Buggy also agreed, Arthur, I haven't defeated you yet, you don't want to lose now. Arthur suppressed the thoughts in his heart, looked at the two, and said with a smile, don't worry, I won't have any accidents, let's go, go to dinner, and then I should have a good rest. Um. Both of them nodded, and the three of them walked towards the restaurant, ready to finish their meal. P.S. Zio King's new book is uploaded. Every day five changes. The first update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 13, The Curtain Ends. Three Months. Progress. Advertisement. Jun. Plus. Both of them had already fallen to the ground, their faces were pale, and they had gradually lost consciousness. Although they were not dead, they were indeed defeated. Compared to the two of them, Arthur was gasping heavily outside, it seems that nothing has changed. Huh. Breathing out a deep breath, Arthur wiped the sweat from his forehead, and said secretly, the body can't bear it, no. To be precise, it is only my current body that can fully release the power of the Red Dragon's blood. It still hasn't been remodeled. Bloodline of the Red Dragon. It is not a certain ability, it is simply wrong to say that it uses a certain power in an explosive manner. Exactly. Arthur's blood of the Red Dragon means that he turned into a humanoid dragon, just. The awakening time of the Red Dragon's blood was too short, and his body was not perfect enough. Just now, he forcibly stimulated the blood. Um. It's a bit overconsumed, and that's probably what it means. Ha ha ha. While Arthur was still thinking about it, Roger laughed and said, Shame. Shame. Is this the strength of Marine? It's not worth mentioning. What Marine Supernova is nothing compared to our kid worth mentioning. Brothers. Retreat. Oh who? The people of the Roger Pirates began to retreat in an orderly manner, and their movements were very skilled. Advertisement. Um. After so many years, I have already been proficient. I have been tracked by Garp again and again for so many years, fighting and retreating. I am really proficient and very familiar with all aspects. There is really no problem. One by one quickly retreated, and Arthur, Shanks, and Buggy also returned to the ship, and then, after a series of familiar but useless actions such as retreat, pursuit, and shelling, the Roger Pirates retreated completely. Seriously. If the Roger Pirates wanted to leave at the beginning, they would have left long ago. There is no need to start a war. Except for Roger to fight with Garp, the more important thing is to let everyone see how strong my little devil is. Much better than any supernova in your marine. This battle. The curtain fell like this, and Garp shook his head when he looked at the two little ghosts who passed out, well. It's not a bad thing. For these two little ghosts, let them wake up and know that they are not invincible. Good thing. People. It's better to accept setbacks earlier, otherwise, when you grow to a certain height, if you can't hold on to the setbacks, then there will really be problems. Now accept the setbacks earlier, although you will lose for a while, as long as you come out, then the future will be an indomitable progress. But. Arthur Pendragon. Brat. I remember you. Garp squinted his eyes. For this outstanding little ghost, he had already remembered it. It is not a good thing for such a little ghost to appear among the pirates. If there is a chance, it is best to deal with it quickly. Best result. Out of Garp's pursuit. Advertisement. Um. This matter has come to an end, and after this battle, 
Arthur not only does not have any complacency, on the contrary, it is just the opposite. Arthur felt even more that his strength was not qualified enough. Jun. Plus. Not to mention the strength of the two of them, but after awakening the blood of the red dragon, it is impossible to accept all the improvements brought by the blood of the red dragon. This is absolutely impossible. Arthur started continuous high-intensity training, and Shanks and Buggy were also very dissatisfied with themselves, what a shame. Looking at Arthur, looking at himself? Under such circumstances, the two little guys also started high-intensity training. The three little guys are training hard every day, and Rayleigh is also teaching daily. And such days lasted for three months. During these three months, Garp came to visit him regularly every month, which was really much more frequent than that of his aunt. However, during these three months, he also met the Babeo Saijun by chance, there was a little fight. Speak up. This probability is also quite low. After all, it is quite interesting to meet by chance on this huge sea. But? For Arthur, these three months have been very hard, he has been training seriously, and he has honed himself very seriously every day. Tick. Advertisement. Tick. Drops of sweat dripped from his forehead, Arthur's small face looked very pale, but he swung the even bigger epee without any pause, every movement was very standard, where to stop, and then lift it up again. And the more so, the more tired he was. What's more, Arthur was still carrying a load on his body. This kind of training, even Shanks, the future four emperors, a real monster, couldn't do it. It is that Arthur's red dragon blood has begun to be fully stimulated, and his resilience is also like that of a red dragon. This is how he can persevere. Huh. Breathing out a deep breath, Arthur finished the training, put down the ape in his hand, wiped the sweat from his forehead, and murmured, I can feel that the blood of the red dragon at this stage has begun to fully exert itself. Only. But. Without waiting for Arthur to think more, Shanks came over and said, Arthur, it's time for dinner. And, you have to pay attention, if this kind of training causes harm to the body, it will be very troublesome. Yes. Yes. Buggy also agreed, Arthur, I haven't defeated you yet, you don't want to lose now. Arthur suppressed the thoughts in his heart, looked at the two, and said with a smile, don't worry, I won't have any accidents, let's go, go to dinner, and then I should have a good rest. Um. Both of them nodded, and the three of them walked towards the restaurant, ready to finish their meal. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. Every day five changes. The first update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 13, The Curtain Ends. Three Months. Progress. Advertisement. Jun. Plus. Both of them had already fallen to the ground, their faces were pale, and they had gradually lost consciousness. Although they were not dead, they were indeed defeated. Compared to the two of them, Arthur was gasping heavily outside, it seems that nothing has changed. Huh. Breathing out a deep breath, Arthur wiped the sweat from his forehead, and said secretly, the body can't bear it, no. To be precise, it is only my current body that can fully release the power of the Red Dragon's blood. It still hasn't been remodeled. Bloodline of the Red Dragon. It is not a certain ability, it is simply wrong to say that it uses a certain power in an explosive manner. Exactly. Arthur's blood of the Red Dragon means that he turned into a humanoid dragon, just. The awakening time of the Red Dragon's blood was too short, and his body was not perfect enough. 
Just now, he forcibly stimulated the blood. Um. It's a bit overconsumed, and that's probably what it means. Ha ha ha. While Arthur was still thinking about it, Roger laughed and said, Shame. Shame. Is this the strength of Marine? It's not worth mentioning. What Marine Supernova is nothing compared to our kid worth mentioning. Brothers. Retreat. Oh who? The people of the Roger Pirates began to retreat in an orderly manner, and their movements were very skilled. Advertisement. Um. After so many years, I have already been proficient. I have been tracked by Garp again and again for so many years, fighting and retreating. I am really proficient and very familiar with all aspects. There is really no problem. One by one quickly retreated, and Arthur, Shanks, and Buggy also returned to the ship, and then, after a series of familiar but useless actions such as retreat, pursuit, and shelling, the Roger Pirates retreated completely. Seriously. If the Roger Pirates wanted to leave at the beginning, they would have left long ago. There is no need to start a war. Except for Roger to fight with Garp, the more important thing is to let everyone see how strong my little devil is. Much better than any supernova in your marine. This battle. The curtain fell like this, and Garp shook his head when he looked at the two little ghosts who passed out, well. It's not a bad thing. For these two little ghosts, let them wake up and know that they are not invincible. Good thing. People. It's better to accept setbacks earlier, otherwise, when you grow to a certain height, if you can't hold on to the setbacks, then there will really be problems. Now accept the setbacks earlier, although you will lose for a while, as long as you come out, then the future will be an indomitable progress. But. Arthur Pendragon. Brat. I remember you. Garp squinted his eyes. For this outstanding little ghost, he had already remembered it. It is not a good thing for such a little ghost to appear among the pirates. If there is a chance, it is best to deal with it quickly. Best result. Out of Garp's pursuit. Advertisement. Um. This matter has come to an end, and after this battle, Arthur not only does not have any complacency, on the contrary, it is just the opposite. Arthur felt even more that his strength was not qualified enough. Jun. Plus. Not to mention the strength of the two of them, but after awakening the blood of the Red Dragon, it is impossible to accept all the improvements brought by the blood of the Red Dragon. This is absolutely impossible. Arthur started continuous high-intensity training, and Shanks and Buggy were also very dissatisfied with themselves, what a shame. Looking at Arthur, looking at himself? Under such circumstances, the two little guys also started high-intensity training. The three little guys are training hard every day, and Rayleigh is also teaching daily. And. Such days lasted for three months. During these three months, Garp came to visit him regularly every month, which was really much more frequent than that of his aunt. However, during these three months, he also met the Babeo Saijun by chance, there was a little fight. Speak up. This probability is also quite low. After all, it is quite interesting to meet by chance on this huge sea. But. For Arthur, these three months have been very hard, he has been training seriously, and he has honed himself very seriously every day. Tick. Advertisement. Tick. Drops of sweat dripped from his forehead, Arthur's small face looked very pale, but he swung the even bigger epee without any pause, every movement was very standard, where to stop, and then lift it up again. And the more so, the more tired he was. What's more, Arthur was still carrying a load on his body. This kind of training, even Shanks, the future four emperors, a real monster, couldn't do it. It is that Arthur's red dragon blood has begun to be fully stimulated, and his resilience is also like that of a red dragon. This is how he can persevere. Huh. Breathing out a deep breath, 
Arthur finished the training, put down the ape in his hand, wiped the sweat from his forehead, and murmured, I can feel that the blood of the red dragon at this stage has begun to fully exert itself. Only. But. Without waiting for Arthur to think more, Shanks came over and said, Arthur, it's time for dinner. And, you have to pay attention, if this kind of training causes harm to the body, it will be very troublesome. Yes. Yes. Buggy also agreed, Arthur, I haven't defeated you yet, you don't want to lose now. Arthur suppressed the thoughts in his heart, looked at the two, and said with a smile, don't worry, I won't have any accidents, let's go, go to dinner, and then I should have a good rest. Um. Both of them nodded, and the three of them walked towards the restaurant, ready to finish their meal. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. Every day five changes. The first update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 14, The Blood of the Red Dragon with Improved Purity. Unlock the first seal of the vowed victory sword. Advertisement. After dinner, Arthur also planned to rest, and, planning to go back to his room to think about it, he also had some other thoughts. Arthur. Mr. Rayleigh. Just when he was about to return to the room, he heard Rayleigh's voice. Arthur turned his head and looked at Rayleigh who was walking step by step, with a look of bewilderment in his eyes. Arthur. Rayleigh came over and said with a smile, would you like to sit down? Okay. Mr. Rayleigh. Arthur didn't refuse, and the two quickly walked aside and sat down. After sitting down, Rayleigh picked up a glass of beer and said, Arthur, you are very impatient inside. Is there anything you are anxious about? Impatient. Arthur was taken aback for a moment, as if he didn't realize it. After a while, he shook his head and said, Mr. Rayleigh, maybe it's because I want to become stronger. Rayleigh shook his head and said, Arthur, you have always been a very mature child, your heart is very mature and stable, I know, you have your own ideas, and you have already seen it, Roger the pirates actually have some problems. Arthur didn't respond to these words. It was undeniable that he knew of course that Roger's physical problems didn't happen all of a sudden. He probably had problems before, but it wasn't so obvious. Advertisement. Rayleigh didn't expect Arthur to answer, but continued, Arthur, you need to calm down your heart. No matter what time it is, you must calm down. You have your own ambitions, so go slowly. It's too much if you are impatient, you will fail. If you calm down, you will find that everything has already come to fruition. Well. Think about it. After Rayleigh said these words, he stood up and left. Arthur sat there quietly, as if he was thinking about something, it was undeniable. As a traverser himself, he is indeed mature and smart enough, but, in the previous life, he was only in his twenties, and in this life he was only nine years old. Actually, my life experience is not so outstanding, and I seem to be too persistent on the road of becoming stronger, and after stopping Rayleigh's words, I seem to understand a little bit. He he he. It's just that I am too eager. Arthur showed a smile, but his heart gradually calmed down, he stood up, jumped off the chair, and returned to his room. Under the night? Calming down his mentality, Arthur took a step forward just like that. Roar. In the blink of an eye, Arthur's soul gradually turned into a giant dragon, and the violent beating of his heart brought out even more terrifying auras, and crimson scales emerged from his body faintly. Of course. It was also accompanied by severe pain. 
the awakening of the blood of the red dragon brought about an increase in strength and also brought great danger. Humph. Advertisement. Arthur let out a groan, but his body was still burning hot. Such pain. It lasted a full night, and the pain did not dissipate until the next day when it was just dawn, and Arthur was lying on the bed sweating profusely. Fortunately, his will was still firm, otherwise, it is simply impossible to bear the change of the blood of the red dragon. Ha! Ha! Lying on the sweat-soaked bed, Arthur panted heavily, and murmured, It's really a terrifying bloodline promotion, is this the bloodline of the red dragon? There was no special bloodline when he first awakened. Feeling, and this time. The increased purity of the red dragon's bloodline brought enormous pressure to him, making it almost unbearable for him. But, Arthur wiped off his sweat, tidied up the room a little and sat down again, at the same time, looking at his panel. Name, Arthur Pendragon. Noble Phantasm, the Sword of Promised Victory, the first seal released, the spear that shines at the end, unlocked, the distant Gensikyo, unlocked. Bloodline, Red Dragon Bloodline, 15%. Island Power, Unawakened. Knights Dash. British Isles. The City of Chalk. Hacky, Conqueror's Hacky, Beginner, Armament Hacky, Beginner, Observation Hacky, Beginner. Um. Advertisement. Arthur looked at his panel, and the Red Dragon bloodline had increased by 5% again, which he probably understood. The first awakening, it was probably an explosive increase of 10% and the follow-up would not be so easy to improve. To be able to increase by 5%, I feel that it is already very good. Only. Arthur muttered strangely, the sword of the oath of victory actually broke the first seal. How did you do it? This. Arthur felt strange, it shouldn't be. Normally, the 13 seals of the sword of vowed victory require 12 knights of the round table, including myself, to agree at the same time, so that the seals can be broken. How can this be broken? But, it seems that this has been considered, and the corresponding inheritance memory has surfaced in his mind. Immediately afterwards, Arthur just understood that the sword of vowed victory does have 13 seals, to be precise. What I untie by myself is only the sword of vowed victory, the power that should be exerted, but because I am too weak, I can't exert it. These thirteen seals were aimed at him, and by unraveling one by one, he could unleash the full power of the Sword of Oath of Victory, but the real thirteen seals? Do not. Do not. It should be said that those are the thirteen shackles of the Sword of Oath of Victory itself. Only in this way can the power capable of destroying stars be perfectly controlled. Arthur has now unlocked the first seal, which is probably equivalent to um upgrade the sword of oath of victory from level 10 equipment to level 20 equipment at the same time can use excalibur naturally the wind king barrier itself has also received a corresponding inheritance generally speaking the harvest is quite good ps zio king's new book is uploaded every day five changes the second update Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the seven day long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 15. The Samurai of Wanakuni. Kojiki Odin. Advertisement. Mr. Rayleigh. Arthur. He he he. Seeing Arthur coming out of the cabin, Rayleigh chuckled and said, It seems, Arthur, you've thought a lot about it. Arthur smiled and nodded, Yes. Indeed, I have figured it out a lot, and after I figured it out, a lot of changes have taken place. That's good. Rayleigh smiled and nodded, 
don't get too entangled, you haven't reached that age yet, Arthur, the road ahead requires you to walk step by step, take your time. He he he. Roger said with a grinning grin, boy Arthur, you are only nine years old, don't make it look like you are ninety years old, that is not a good thing. Don't age prematurely. Listening to Captain Roger's words, Arthur couldn't help saying with black lines all over his head, Captain Roger, you'd better shut up. It might be better if you don't speak. Ha ha ha. Roger laughed out loud, then took out a newspaper and said, Look at this, the white beard pirates have been making quite a fuss recently. White beard pirates. Arthur froze for a moment, then tilted his head. Advertisement. To be frank. I am no stranger to the white beard pirates, but this memory comes from my previous life, that is, before time traveling. It has been a total of eight years since my time traveling, and I have not seen the white beard pirates yet. Actually. Not only white beard pirates, Wufeng pirates, John pirates, Silver Axe pirates, Big Mom pirates, but also Baloric, Air pirates, and more. These big men have never seen it before. The only ones I have seen are Burndy from the Ward Pirates and Green Pepper from the Eight Treasures Navy. As for the reason? In fact, it is very simple. The sea is very huge. After a little understanding, Arthur found that although this world has very few lands and is generally islands, the mask is several times larger than the Blue Star in his previous life, even ten times. So. They are all sailing in the new world. If you are not deliberately looking for each other, under the sailing of these free pirates, you want to meet by chance, it is really not an easy task. Um. Jabba walked over and said, Indeed, Arthur, Shanks, Buggy, none of you have seen that guy Whitebeard, but? Forget it, it doesn't matter, but? This time, the Whitebeard pirates made a big fuss what? It's making a big fuss. Arthur froze for a moment, tilted his head strangely, thinking about what happened at this point in time. Warrior. Samurai of Wanakuni. Wow. Isn't that the legendary country? Yes. Advertisement. Shanks and Buggy have already started complaining with the newspapers. The two of them did not expect that the country of Wanakuni would appear. Arthur reacted immediately when he heard this. Rayleigh said, Wanakuni is a closed country on the Grand Line. It has never joined the world government, nor is it a member country, but it has extremely strong strength. According to legend, Wanakuni has amazing warriors, and the power of warriors is very special. It's so powerful, even to say. It was rumored that Wanakuni had gold, but it didn't have any effect. Instead, it forged the reputation of dragon-slaying warrior Ryoma. Besides, the people in Wanakuni are also very repulsive to the outside world. No one knows what the inside of Wanakuni is like. So, Arthur followed Rayleigh's words and said, I never thought that there would be a samurai from Wanakuni joining the Whitebeard Pirates. Yes. Rayleigh smiled and nodded, smiling at Arthur, for Arthur. I am really very satisfied. All along, I have been teaching Arthur very seriously, in all aspects. This can be regarded as caring and loving for a child. Actually. Arthur, Shanks, Buggy. The three little guys have the same status in the Roger Pirates, and they are all treated as children by these guys. Only. Everyone's focus is different. Rayleigh is a wise and courageous grandmaster who has a lot of abilities and likes to act before he can. He is more optimistic about Arthur, after all. Arthur, who works hard, will not be hated. And Roger likes Shanks more, in Roger's view, Shanks is almost exactly like himself. As for Jabba. But I like Buggy even more, Jabba is careless but has a delicate mind, and Buggy is always like a funny guy but his heart is full of viciousness. Advertisement. Well. This is also a normal thing, 
everyone in the Roger Pirates is a companion, but? Even if it is a companion, it is normal to have a better relationship and a slightly dull relationship with each other, isn't it? Ha ha ha. Roger laughed and said, I really want to meet you. This samurai from Wanakuni. Arthur looked at Captain Roger and knew that at this moment, Captain Roger actually had some different situations, but? I didn't say anything, this is not something I can handle. Well. Little ones. Roger suddenly turned his head and yelled, Laozi is making trouble. Damn white beard pirates, the bounty increase is faster than ours, this is absolutely unacceptable. Oh who? That's right. Ha ha ha. The pirates immediately started laughing wildly, everyone was full of excitement, just kidding. It is also one of the three legendary pirate groups, how could it be overwhelmed by the white beard pirate group? This is something they absolutely disagree with. He he he. Watching the scene quietly, Arthur chuckled and shook his head, sure enough. No matter at any time, the Roger pirates seem to be crazy, to put it bluntly, they seem to have a brain problem, but? This is the real pirate, real and unpretentious, and will never disguise his false side. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. Every day five changes. The third update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the seven day long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 16, Wandering Ghost. Bullet for door-to-door -door challenge. Advertisement. Pirates. This is a group of crazy guys. They go to sea for their own ambitions and dreams. Everyone will go on unswervingly toward their own goals. This is this group of crazy pirates. The overall bounty of the white beard pirates has increased very rapidly because of Kojiki Odin's uproar. Therefore. Joke. The Roger pirates, of course, couldn't accept it, and each of them immediately started to make trouble without hesitation, and the bounty was also increasing. And. The Roger pirates, who were making a fuss, were targeted by one person. Snapped. Snapped. In the darkness, a tall figure with blonde hair came out. Looking at the newspaper in his hand, he grinned and said ferociously, Roger Pirates. Gould Roger. Ha ha ha. I am coming. He was like an evil spirit wandering in the sea, and at this moment, this evil spirit was eyeing Roger. As for why gold? The reason is simple. The world government hides Roger's real surname and hides his D. Many people only know that Roger's surname is Gold. Why? There are quite a few D-clans above the sea, why hide Roger specifically? Advertisement. This will involve the Valley of Gods. Roger and Garp team up to beat the rocks, and... The three of them are all members of the D-family, so Garp won't say anything, but Roger definitely needs to think about it. Five elders have hidden Roger's real name for safety. Up. Up. Ha ha ha. Another 60 million Bailey's bounty has been raised. Awesome. This surpasses the white beard pirates. That's right. Everyone in the Roger pirates was laughing one by one at this moment. The reason they were messing around so much during this time was of course to increase their bounties. For pirates, offering a bounty basically represents their second face. Hmm. Arthur looked at the bounty offered, but shook his head and said, it seems that I haven't been offered a reward yet. Ha ha ha. Still need to work hard. Roger patted Arthur on the shoulder with a casual look on his face, at the same time. Very inadvertently, he leaked out his 4 billion bounty reward order. Arthur looked at this scene, and silently looked at Captain Roger who seemed like a fool, what should I say? Captain Roger in my family is really like a second fool, 
you can't be like this, can you? Really are. Yes. Advertisement. Both Rayleigh and Jabba shook their heads helplessly. With the character of their own captain, they really didn't know what to say. But? Rayleigh came over and said, it's not surprising that Arthur didn't get a reward, after all. Arthur is too young, but? He has shown amazing talent and aptitude. Not sure. Indeed. Jabba nodded in agreement, and West Carl, Sand Bell, and others also agreed very much. Arthur is only nine years old. At this age, he awakened Conqueror's Haki, and defeated the team of Marine Supernovas Jun and Kaji, and he is also a member of the Roger Pirates, so that's why. How much bounty do you give more appropriate? This. That's a problem in itself, so for the time being, Arthur doesn't show up with a bounty. But? Arthur shook his head and said, I'm not interested in bounties. After all. Arthur knew himself, he had different ambitions, and. If it is not offered a reward, then of course it is the best. If it is selected, on the contrary, it is a slightly bad thing. Everyone didn't bother with this matter, but Yaman, the only female crew member of the Roger Pirates, armed with a long gun, had disheveled hair and was dressed like a jungle warrior, said, calculating the time, there is still about a month and a half to go. Time, is it New Year's? Yes. It's the New Year again, it's another year. What? Mentioning this matter, everyone also began to discuss it. Even though. This is the world of the big pirate, but there is still a new year in this world, after all. Cough 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 I understand everything. As for the new year, people in this world also attach great importance to it. Even pirates will basically have a good meal and hold a banquet. Advertisement. Although pirates basically have banquets most of the time, this is just the character of pirates. New year. Roger rubbed his chin, thought for a while and said, any ideas for this year's new year? Jabba shook his head and said, I don't have any special thoughts, but? We still have to pay attention to it. Um. Listening to Jabba's words, both Roger and Rayleigh nodded. This is a very important day, and we still need to pay attention to it. Um. Um. All the members of the Roger Pirates, who were discussing in full swing, suddenly stopped and turned their heads in unison, including Arthur, Shanks, and Buggy, all of whom were silently looking into the distance. There is something. The terrifying aura that seemed to be like an evil ghost was galloping towards it at a fast speed. Even though. Compared with Arthur, Shanks, and Buggy seem weaker, but there is no doubt that the two little guys are able to develop the two-color hacking. Shanks's talent does not need to be said, and Buggy's talent is actually not weak. It's just decadent in the original book, but now under the stimulation of Arthur, Buggy's talent is also displayed. He has mastered the two-color hacky, and his strength is not even weaker than that of Shanks of the same age. Clatter. Clatter. But at this time, with the churning of the waves, a ship was galloping towards him, and standing on the ship was the figure of a tall young man, with the corners of his mouth open, as ferocious as a ghost. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. Every day five changes. Fourth update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 17, Arthur's Bullet, The Red Dragon and Ghost's Battle. Advertisement. Douglas Bullet. Ghost. This is his title which comes from the Nation of Endless War. He tried his best, but was still betrayed by his companions. From that moment, he destroyed his country and his army, and was recognized by the world government. Wanted. 
Therefore, Bullet has become a lunatic, all he wants to do is challenge the strong, become stronger step by step, and become the most powerful monster in the world. And this kind of him has no clear belief in his heart, what he wants to do is to challenge, challenge monsters one by one step by step. Gold Roger. Ha ha ha. Bullet said excitedly, I finally found it. Come on. Let's fight. Let me kill you. Roger just looked at Bullet quietly, his eyes filled with peace, and after a while, he said, Arthur, are you sure you can defeat him? What? Arthur was stunned. Originally, he was watching a play, but he was actually involved in it. Seriously. Arthur agrees with Bullet's strength, Bullet is very strong, but... That's Bullet after advancing into prison for 20 years. The current Bullet? Arthur is just two words, he he. No joke. But it's the real thing, he he, these two words are enough, Bullet claims to be in the Roger Pirates, except for Roger, Rayleigh is a tie, isn't this the same as nonsense? Advertisement. Rayleigh and Java are neck and neck, and the rest of the pack is plentiful. The results of it? Bullet, who boasted so much, after leaving the Roger Pirates, ended up going head to head with a newcomer like Crocodile. Isn't it a tie? To be honest. The members of the Roger Pirates do not want to attack Bullet. For Bullet, failure is almost fatal. It is enough to have a goal to pursue. More. It will only break Bullet's heart and cause problems for Bullet. To put it more simply, everyone in the Roger Pirates is just acting with Bullet. Arthur. Roger turned his head, looked at Arthur, and said with a smile, Boy, are you confident? He he he. Captain Roger. No problem. Arthur smiled without any hesitation. If this is the case, then let yourself try it out. With the blood of the red dragon with a higher purity, the sword of vowed victory that unlocked the first seal, now how strong is he? How? I am nine years old. Bullet is fifteen years old. Try it out. But? Even if it is a try, Arthur is determined to win and goes forward. Never say never. No matter at any time, as long as he participated in the battle, he must go on firmly. It's not that Arthur can't accept failure, but he doesn't want to lose. Ha ha ha. No problem. Advertisement. Roger gave a thumbs up, then turned his head and said, Little devil, if you want to challenge Laozi, then defeat Laozi's trainee pirate. Apprentice pirate. Kill you. There was only terrifying killing intent in Bullet's eyes, he took a deep leap, and came straight to Arthur, his fists turned black, and slammed down fiercely from top to bottom. Only. Boom. An astonishing scene appeared. Compared with Bullet, who was tall and looked like a monster, Arthur's thin body clenched his fists, also entangled with armament hacky and greeted him. As the deafening roar resounded, the two people's forehands collided with dark purple thunder lights, and the two seemed to be tied. What an amazing power! It seemed to be a voice with emotion, but the next moment, the muscles of Arthur's arms swelled inch by inch, wisps of crimson light were faintly visible, and even more terrifying power burst out from Arthur's body. Roar. The roar of the red dragon was looming, and Arthur's terrifying punch directly sent Bullet flying. How is this possible? Bullet's eyes widened in disbelief, he turned around suddenly in mid-air, and landed on his own boat, his eyes were full of disbelief. Impossible. Impossible. Bullet couldn't even accept it. In the past year since he went to sea, his own strength is absolutely strong. No matter what opponent he is, he is not his opponent. The results of it? Facing the Roger Pirates myself, in my opinion, except for the Captain Roger, other people are not worth mentioning at all, and it turned out. The end result was that he was punched out by Arthur, who was a trainee pirate. Advertisement. This is something that I simply cannot accept. 
ha ha ha. Seeing this scene, Roger grinned and said, Little brat, do you want to accept this battle? That's right. If you lose, you will be a trainee pirate of Roger's pirate group from today onwards. Lao Z will give you a chance to challenge me if you beat Arthur the Kid. Do you accept? Of course I accept. Bullet's aura became even more frightening, his whole body exuded an extremely terrifying aura, and his whole body was as ferocious as a terrifying evil ghost, and said crazily, no one can stop me. No matter who you can't stop me. Ugh. Arthur shook his head helplessly, and said, Captain Roger, he has a mental problem. Roger nodded with a smile and said, of course I know he has mental problems, but he is an excellent kid after all, Arthur, help me deal with it. Ken. However, you have to pay more. No problem. Ha ha ha. Listening to the joking conversation between Arthur and Roger, everyone couldn't help laughing, but... Everyone found it very interesting. Bullet is definitely the most outstanding monster among the teenagers above the sea. As for Arthur's talent, they all watched him grow up, there is absolutely no doubt about it, what will be the result? P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. Nissan 5th Watch. 5th Update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo Evaluation. P.S. Brothers. The daily five shifts are over. Now it is 7,900 flowers, and it is still 1,100 away from adding flowers, brothers. Work hard. Xiao Qing continues to add another chapter today. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time. October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 18, Genius. Pervert. Then it is enough for me to be a monster. Advertisement. Snapped. Snapped. Following the sound of gentle footsteps, Arthur and Bullet walk towards the depths of the isolated island, step by step, and everyone in the Roger Pirates followed quickly. Hmm. There are countless isolated islands like this in this world. They don't have special resources or terrain, so they won't be taken seriously by people at all. It's here. Arthur stopped, looked at Bullet and smiled, the battle has begun. He he he. Bullet said ferociously, yes. The battle has begun, and Laozi can't wait to kill you. Snapped. Without any hesitation, the next moment, Bullet came straight towards Arthur like a ferocious beast. What a grumpy fellow. Arthur felt very helpless, Bullet really had a psychological problem, but... It's not surprising that he grew up from the battlefield since he was a baby. It would be the strangest thing if he had no psychological problems. But... A sharp light flashed in Arthur's eyes, and the next moment, the whole person met Bullet without any fear. Crackling. Advertisement. Crackling. The speed of the confrontation between the two is getting faster and faster, and it has reached the point where it looks like an after image. The two people are colliding crazily with fists to flesh, just. The moment each attack landed, Armament Hacky had blocked the opponent's attack. Short time. The two have fought against each other for many times, but. Bullet known as a ghost above the sea, has no advantage in Arthur's hands. Instead. Roar. Bullet let out a deafening roar, but at this moment it was full of loopholes, the empty door was wide open, Arthur stepped forward, and the punch hit Bullet directly in the abdomen without any reservation. Search. Bullet's roar was forced to stop abruptly, and finally flew upside down, while Arthur shook his head and said, he is purely a lunatic, and his fighting style is honed on the battlefield, and he is completely fighting for his life. The most suitable technique for killing people. Arthur said it very easily, but since this technique is the most suitable for killing people, 
how could it be so easily cracked? The reason is simple. Arthur's strength was stronger, and he had even more astonishing skills. Because of this, he was able to suppress Bullet with his skills, otherwise, it would have been so easy. At this time. Clatter. Bullet got up from the ruins, shook his head, but he seemed unscathed, such an attack could not do anything to Bullet. Ken. Roar. Bullet let out a deafening roar, and his whole body was covered with a layer of dark purple armament hacky, but it was different. Compared to normal people, Bullet's armament hacky seems to be more weird and terrifying. Roar. Advertisement. Roaring like a beast again, Bullet put his foot on the ground and came straight for Arthur. Click. The ground collapsed in an instant, and at this instant, Bullet had already arrived in front of Arthur, and the punch hit Arthur's head directly. Fist of death. Under one punch. It seemed Arthur's life had been thrown here. Huh. Arthur let out a deep breath, and the sharp dragon eye suddenly lifted up, your armament hacky is very strong? Okay. Then let's try and see who is stronger. Wave. The same dark purple armament hacky covered Arthur's whole body. Facing Bullet's fatal punch, not only did he not back down, but he took the initiative to step forward, as if to meet him even more terrifyingly. Boom. The surrounding ground collapsed inch by inch in an instant, and after the two punches collided, countless shadows of fists fell crazily towards each other, too fast. Too fast. Just like two after images. This moment. It wasn't like two people at all, it was like two lunatics, and Bullet was a lunatic, otherwise he couldn't be called a ghost. What about Arthur? Arthur is a cool guy, just. Don't forget, Arthur's blood is the blood of the Red Dragon. Facing such a lunatic opponent, the terrifying blood of the Red Dragon is also awakened, Dragon. But it has never been a friendly creature. Crackling. Advertisement. Rumble. The fist clash between the two became more and more intense, and in the midst of this fight, the conqueror's hacky of the two leaked at the same time. Next moment. The conqueror's hacky of the two also landed on each other's body crazily. Every punch fell very hard, as if they wanted to tear each other apart. Fist of power. Die to me. Bullet let out a frenzied roar and he threw his right hand fiercely behind him, and the next moment, he punched himself directly on the head again, this punch meant to tear Arthur apart. Every muscle in the entire right arm began to expand rapidly, as if all the strength of the whole body was concentrated on this punch. Wind King Hammer Facing Bullet's blow, Arthur was not afraid at all. Are you scary? You are a genius? Are you a monster? Are you pervert? Whatever you are. Well, I just need to be stronger, and I just need to be a more terrifying monster. Arthur's right arm also seemed to disappear at the same time, the next moment. But a more terrifying cyan gust burst out, and this endless gust of wind gathered into the shape of a hammer. Boom. The two collided fiercely, and the surrounding ground exploded instantly again, and the feet of the two were like spider webs, cracking wildly towards the surroundings, under the astonishing destructive power. The fighting spirit of these two people became more and more intense. Bullet's eyes shone with a dark purple light, while Arthur's pupils had completely turned into crimson dragon pupils. The two are full of fighting spirit, but they will not back down in any way. Until the other party is defeated. P.S. Zio King's new book is uploaded. Every day 5 changes. 6th update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. P.S. 9000 flowers plus more. Brothers. Continue to beg for data, flowers. Monthly pass. Reward. Evaluation. You can rest assured. As long as Xiaoqing has enough data, she will definitely add updates crazily. 
Not a single chapter. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 19, Under the Storm. The Red Dragon Defeats the Ghost. Advertisement. Arthur's battle with Bullet intensifies. Peripheral. Roger, Rayleigh, Jabba, and others all watched the battlefield quietly. Seriously. Although the two of them played in a fancy way, but uh. Just this level? In their eyes, it is really nothing. It is undeniable that the strength of the two little guys is good, but in their eyes, they are really good. Um. Jabba nodded and said, Boy Arthur's strength has really improved very quickly. Compared with that old mad dog Garp, his strength has improved a lot. Indeed. Listening to Jabba's words, everyone nodded in agreement, while Rayleigh shook his head and said with a smile, Arthur has his own depression in his heart, but he understands his heart very simply. Most importantly. Um. Um. Everyone nodded again and again, it is undeniable. Mentality is really very important, no matter how powerful it is, if there is no corresponding mentality, then it is meaningless. Check out bullets. Enough to call it a genius, right? But, in Arthur's eyes, bullet is full of flaws, because there is a problem with his mentality. Such a mentality is very unfeasible in a battle, of course. Arthur was just talking, what if you were to be a 40-year-old bullet 25 years from now? Arthur turned and left, just kidding. I don't want to fail, but I definitely don't want to die. Advertisement. Not to mention. After Bullet was arrested and entered Impel Down, he has understood a lot. Although he is still crazy, his heart is more determined. Shanks and Buggy looked at the battlefield quietly, and they clenched their fists as they watched the amazing strength of the two fighting fiercely in front of them. They also have to work harder, both of them have amazing talents, they will not just relax and give up like this, they also have to work harder to become stronger. Fist of Power Wind King Hammer It was another collision of the same moves, and the fierce battle between the two had entered a white-hot stage. Um. As Arthur continues to develop the blood of the Red Dragon, he already has more inherited memories, such as the method of using the Wind King Barrier, actually. The Wind King Barrier is not a special magic, this magic is quite simple. Only. Under King Arthur's bug-like magic power, this is the scariest thing. Although Arthur is not good at magic, it doesn't mean that his magic power is scarce, on the contrary. My magic power is scary, don't forget, I am the blood of the Red Dragon. Two fists flew one after another, and under the terrifying gust of wind, Arthur's wind hammer smashed down frantically one after another. Bullet was originally evenly matched, but under Arthur's bombardment with no money at all, over time, he was suppressed. Asshole. Roar. Advertisement. What? Bullet retreated one after another, which was gradually unacceptable to him. With the crazy but insane roar, he let out deafening roars, and the breath in his whole body became stronger and stronger. Of terror. Worth to talk about. In this world, there are some people with very special talents, and these people with special talents can exert more powerful powers, such as ghost aura and murderous aura, while some people can use ghost aura and murderous aura, hacky three combined. Bullet is such a talented person, just. Now he is too young, and these three powers can't be perfectly combined. Under such circumstances, a forced fusion. Wow. Bullet himself spat out a mouthful of blood instead. Arthur took advantage of this opportunity, but without any mercy, he punched Bullet without hesitation. This punch directly sent Bullet flying. Next moment. Bullet turned around in mid-air, and landed directly on the ground, smashing the ground into two deep holes, but his crazy eyes were fixed on Arthur. 
I don't know, I thought there was someone who killed his father. The revenge of taking his wife. The strongest fist. But? Bullet is still Bullet, even if he is slightly injured, he still supports his body and forcibly gathers the three forces together to form his strongest punch. This is your last blow. Arthur's voice was very calm, as if he couldn't see any changes, but there was a sharp fighting intent in his eyes. If so. Advertisement. Buzz. Arthur directly drew out the sword of vowed victory, and seeing this scene, Roger, Rayleigh, Jabba, and others all restrained their smiles and became slightly dignified. Actually. They all knew very well that this kid Arthur was quite capable, yes. Compared with physical skills, Arthur's strongest skill is swordsmanship. What he needs to face Bullet is to defeat Bullet, so it is most appropriate to defeat him in this way. How to say? If Arthur's physical skills were level 100, his kendo would be almost level 105, yes. The problem is that the two kinds of Arthur have completely different degrees of danger. Ken. Now Arthur has drawn out his sword of vowed victory, so the meaning is completely different, if it can't stop Arthur's blow, then. Bullet is absolutely mortal, this is no joke. Wind King Barrier. Arthur held the sword in one hand, and the Wind King's enchantment instantly hid the curry stick, followed closely behind. A terrifying magic power burst out from his body, and under the astonishing magic power, his hair began to move automatically without wind. Arthur flicked the curry stick in his hand, and said seriously, Bullet. I won't show mercy. I hope you can survive. Wind King Hammer. Arthur let out a soft shout, under the strong wind, Bullet had already been defeated. P.S. Zio King's new book is uploaded. Every day five changes. The first update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo Evaluation. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate Recharge, Activity Time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 20, Roger Pirates Apprentice Pirates, Douglas Bullet. Advertisement. Boom. The powerful roar was endless, and the battle, with this final blow, had also come to an end. Ha. Ha. Arthur gasped heavily, propping himself up with a sword on the ground with one hand, and said secretly, Bullet. You are indeed one of the monsters in the future. At this age and with mental problems, he can be so terrifying. Humph. With a muffled groan, Arthur felt that his consciousness was gradually blurring, but... I still persisted, kept calm, and let myself gradually calm down, eh. Pulled off, face bullet. Such a high-intensity battle, although the battle is over in just a short time from beginning to end. But the problem is. The intensity of the battle was too terrifying. Arthur defeated bullet with the blood of the red dragon, but he was also uncomfortable. After all, compared to the 15-year-old Bullet, I am only 9 years old now, so I still suffer a lot in terms of age. Huh. Taking a deep breath, Shanks and Buggy had already run over, they supported Arthur, and hurriedly asked, Arthur, are you alright? Arthur put away the curry sticks, supported by two people, and said with a smile, don't worry, I'm fine. I'm just exhausted. Next, I should take a good rest. Huh. Huh. While talking, Arthur was already tired and fell asleep. Looking at Arthur who had fallen asleep, he was especially sure that the two little guys breathed a sigh of relief after Arthur really fell asleep. At this time, Roger, Rayleigh, Jabba, and others also came over. Advertisement. Soon. A group of people returned to the ship, including Bullet. As the pirate ship sailed to the distance, everyone left. After resting for a day, Arthur woke up, and his body was almost recovered. After all, 
It's not that I have any injuries because I just lost my strength. As long as I recover well, of course it will not be a problem. Very hungry. Arthur clutched his stomach, his face was abnormally pale, changed his clothes, walked out of the room, and went straight to the kitchen. It happened to be in time for lunch, and he ate big mouthfuls. As Arthur woke up, the injured bullet also woke up. Come over. But, compared to Arthur, Bullet is much worse, and he probably needs to lie down in bed for a while. Besides, nobody knows exactly what Roger said to Bullet. Only, Arthur, Arthur, Buggy approached mysteriously and said, Have you heard? Bullet has become a trainee pirate of the Roger Pirates. Advertisement Arthur put down the ape in his hand, wiped his sweat, and said casually, isn't this a normal thing? Captain Roger's initial bet with Bullet was to let Bullet stay in Roger's pirate group as an apprentice pirate. To be frank, Arthur knows that this has changed a lot. Compared with the original book, Bullet joined the Roger pirates as a challenger, and now he is an apprentice pirate. This is already a huge change. As for why Captain Roger in his own family values Bullet so much. Amount. Arthur really didn't know much about it, and he wasn't particularly interested in it, which didn't delay him, let alone. After Bullet joins, I can hone myself by fighting Bullet when I have nothing to do. Shanks and Buggy are inferior to myself, and they challenge stronger people. They suppress and fight against themselves, which is of no benefit. Now, Bullet, who is weaker than himself, joins Roger Pirates the regiment, of course, is the best training partner. Buggy smacked his lips and said, I know, I just didn't expect that he would really choose to stay. Mentioning this matter, Arthur thought for a while, and said seriously, as a man. If you are not firm enough in what you say, it would be too embarrassing. I see. Understood. Buggy waved his hand and left, Arthur didn't say anything more, Buggy is suitable to be a friend, just. Buggy is also a cunning and vicious person, so he can be a friend, but what about cooperation and other aspects? Never mind. Buggy God tier is not something that can be cooperated by itself. And. Arthur knows very well that in the world of pirates, nothing is an absolute friend. This is the world of pirates. You can attack anyone, no matter who you are, unless you are a partner of a pirate group. If the cooperation between the two pirate groups is meaningless. Advertisement. Seriously. There are actually very few betrayers in the same pirate group. The reason is very simple. Such betrayers have such a bad reputation in the sea that they are almost unable to move an inch. As for Teach, that's because Teach is too strong. Otherwise, if you try to betray with a weaker pirate, that's where problems can really arise. Arthur, just as Buggy left, Shanks walked over quickly and said, Did you know the news about Bullet? Arthur nodded and said, Of course I know, Shanks, you asked the same question as Buggy. Ha ha ha. Shanks scratched his head and said with a big grin, how can I put it? I didn't expect Bullet to keep his promise. That man is like a lunatic. I thought he wouldn't keep his promise. Hmm. Arthur thought for a while, and said, Bullet wants to challenge the stronger, wants to become stronger, grows up on the battlefield, is betrayed by the army, betrayed by the country, how do you expect him to be mentally better? But. Bullet will still keep his promise, and after fighting with me, there should be changes for Bullet. Arthur analyzed it. Compared with coaxing the children in the original book, it is cruel to wake Bullet up with a mouthful now, but as long as Bullet persists, it will definitely be immediate. What did you say? What if Bullet didn't hold on? That has something to do with Arthur. P.S. Zio King's new book is uploaded. Every day five changes. The second update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. 
Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyu Evaluation. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate Recharge, Activity Time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 21, New Year. Gift. Devil Fruit. Advertisement. Tick. Tick. Sweat Drift, and the hard-working people of the Roger Pirates changed from Arthur alone to a duo. It turns out, Bullet is really evil. After being defeated by Arthur, he not only stabilized his heart, but also worked hard. Unlike the coaxing children in the original book, Bullet now understands that he is nothing and needs more assiduous efforts, as for the problem of companions. That was Roger's future, and Arthur wasn't going to be a part of it. So. Daily hard training has become a duo of Arthur and Bullet. It is worth mentioning that Bullet now has a real X-shaped scar on his chest, which was left on Bullet when Arthur's hammer of the Wind King fell. As for why such a scar is left behind. Arthur could only say that this was really a coincidence, and he really didn't do it on purpose. But, not only did Bullet not care, but he was generous. In Bullet's words, this is his own glory. Failure is not terrible. He can accept failure and just keep working hard. Um. Generally speaking, apart from Bullet's extreme personality and pursuit of strength, he is actually good in daily life, especially as a penance duo. Arthur and Bullet are pretty good. Same. Advertisement. When Rayleigh taught Arthur, he would also teach Bullet. Under such circumstances, over time, Bullet also ushered in rapid progress. Same. Bullet is advancing by leaps and bounds, and Arthur is also working extremely hard, just kidding. Is this the way to just beat someone, and then turn around and let him dunk? No. No. I can't afford to lose this person. The penance duo brought in what seemed like crazy improvements, and Shanks and Buggy were also improving rapidly when forced to do so. All in all. Trainee foursome, rolled up. Time flies very fast. Short time. The new year has arrived, although the weather is scary hot now, but. This is the weather on the Grand Line, you never know what's going to happen next, after all. It's the standard configuration of the Grand Line. Little devils. Ha ha ha. Roger laughed and said hello, you little devils, take it easy, today is the new year, just take a day off. You don't have to work so hard. Huh. Both Arthur and Bullet breathed a sigh of relief, while Shanks and Buggy fell limply on the ground. Not to mention their aptitude, but in terms of physical fitness, the future duo of four emperors is really inferior to the two monsters. Group of people. Arthur put down the ape, wiped his sweat, and asked doubtfully, Captain Roger, is today the new year? He he he. Rayleigh walked over step by step and said with a smile, Arthur, it's also very important to combine work and rest. You obviously don't know which day is which day. Snapped. Advertisement. Snapped. Bullet also took off the weights one by one and wiped the sweat from his head. He was similar to Arthur in training the hardest. A bald head from the Roger Pirates came over. He had sparse stubble and wore clothes similar to military uniforms. He was also similar to Bullet. He came out of the army of a country and had the position of captain. His name was Mulian. Mulian and Bullet have a good relationship. After all, their experiences are very similar. Mulian smiled and said, Bullet, take it easy, we are all companions here, we are no longer in the army. Companion. Bullet was more or less hesitant, but? It has been more than a month since he joined the Roger Pirates. He did not join as a challenger, but as a trainee pirate. Naturally, his feeling and attitude are different. Arthur smiled and said nothing, how should I put it, 
a place like Roger Pirates really gives people a different feeling. For this group of funny comparisons, those who join will really feel that everyone is a companion. Even Bullet is included. Yup. Yup. Today is the new year, have a good rest. Ha ha ha. Jackson Banner has curly hair that covers his eyes, and he is grinning, and the others are walking over one by one. They are all very sincere to Bullet. For them, as long as they are companions, everyone is full of love. Sincerely. I see. Bullet was still a little dazed, but still nodded in such an atmosphere. Correct. Advertisement. Correct. Yao Yi, with his hairstyle like flames, wearing a cloak and putting his hands in his pockets, suddenly said, Captain Roger has prepared gifts for you for little guys, but? I don't know what the gifts are. Gift. What? Um. Arthur, Shanks, and Buggy all seemed very confused, not to mention Bullet. He had never had a gift. For him, he was a soldier from birth, and he was even regarded as his father by the chief. Betrayal, the word gift is very at a loss for him. Everyone was quite curious, but Roger said carefreely, really. Yeah, ye, you bastard, Lao Z is planning to see how shocked these brats look. Ha ha ha. Roger. Really are. Listening to Roger's words, everyone couldn't help laughing, it really is the character of their own Captain Roger. Everyone is used to it. However, after being told that it was broken, Roger did not hide. Instead, he took out the gifts prepared for everyone, each with a small treasure box, and handed them to everyone, except for Shanks. Roger looked at Shanks and said seriously, Shanks, I will give you a special gift. Um. Shanks was very confused, while Arthur looked at the treasure chest in front of him and fell into deep thought, because he felt the breath of devil fruit. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. Every day five changes. The third update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the seven day long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 22, The Choice of Roger's Will, Shanks. Advertisement. Creek. Snapped. Snapped. The door opened, and Arthur walked into the room with the treasure box, and then he opened the treasure box directly. As expected, five devil fruits were neatly placed there, because his 3 no system needs to absorb devil fruits to have energy. Draw cards. Therefore, with my 3 no system, whenever a devil fruit appears within my range, I can directly sense it. Five devil fruits. This. Arthur couldn't help being dazed. When Captain Roger handed over the treasure chest to him just now, he already knew what was inside, just. Unexpectedly, there are a total of five devil fruits inside, this number is indeed a bit too much. Arthur picked up the note from the treasure chest. Ha ha ha. Arthur boy. Lao Z knows that you are collecting devil fruit, although he said, I don't know why you collect devil fruit, but. This year has passed, and you are also ten years old. This is a gift from Lao Z, the captain, to you, a total of five devil fruits. Captain Roger. Really are. Arthur smiled couldn't help but shook his head with a smile, obviously these things have nothing to do with Captain Roger. Five devil fruits? Some people may think, isn't that the price of 500 million baileys in the black market? This thing is not expensive either. Advertisement. Indeed. It seems not expensive, but think about it for a while, is there really someone who buys devil fruit on the black market? Devil fruit was either given by various pirate groups and forces, or found by chance. Is there really that kind of devil fruit bought on the black market? 
actually there is. But it is almost rare, because almost no one will sell the devil fruit, no matter how weak the devil fruit is, as long as you eat it and cultivate it a little, it will be a good elite. Why should I sell it? Therefore, although the price of devil fruit in the black market is 100 million baileys, the actual transaction price is at least 300 million to 500 million baileys, and this is still a price without a market. It can be said that even Roger Pirates the group is one of the three legendary pirate groups above the sea. But, the situation of the Roger Pirates really understands everything, they really don't have much money, and Devil Fruit is not something that can be obtained with money. Really? With a touch of emotion in his voice, Arthur smiled and shook his head, but he didn't say much. There are some words that don't need to be said, just put them quietly in his heart. Roar! The looming dragon chant resounded instantly, and the phantom of the red dragon appeared behind Arthur, and he ate all five devil fruits in one go. Huh. Slightly exhaling a dirty breath, Arthur felt it for a while, and after confirming that there was no problem, he walked out of the room, and there was still a banquet to attend. Same. Both Bullet and Buggy got their own gifts. Buggy got a treasure map, which was the treasure map of a very powerful big pirate 200 years ago. For Buggy who likes treasures, this is simply the most exciting gift. Advertisement As for Bullets Bullets gift is actually very simple, even compared to Arthur and Buggy's gift, the simplicity is a bit too much, a very simple set of new clothes and a dagger, but it is just such a new set of clothes and a dagger is such a simple gift, but to Bullet, that kind of meaning is the greatest. A new set of clothes A new dagger this. For Bullet, it really seems to represent a new beginning of life, so to speak. Under Arthur's change, the current Bullet has become different inside, and this butterfly has brought a huge impact. Snapped. Snapped. Mr. Rayleigh. Arthur had just stepped out of the cabin and saw Mr. Rayleigh standing aside. He threw himself a bottle of beer just as he stepped out. Although only ten years old, but, isn't it just drinking? Small issue. Arthur. Rayleigh looked at Arthur, seemingly silent, he didn't know what to say. What's wrong? Arthur was also a little confused, until he saw Captain Roger walking over with Shanks, and Shanks wore the straw hat that belonged to Captain Roger on his head. It would be strange if I didn't know what was going on. He he he. Arthur chuckled and said gently, Mr. Rayleigh, you should know that for me, I am actually not suitable to be Captain Rogers' heir. Captain Rogers' will does not belong to me. I have my own ambition, that is my future. Advertisement. Snapped. Clenching a fist with one hand, Arthur seems to have grasped the entire world. At this moment, Arthur is full of endless confidence. That kind of self-confidence of a king is what people value the most. Ugh. Seeing Arthur's appearance, Rayleigh also smiled and shook his head, I just don't think this is fair to you. Obviously you are the most outstanding child, but... The final result is still the same. Arthur smiled and said, Mr. Rayleigh, what doesn't suit you will never suit you. Never mind. Seeing Arthur's appearance, Rayleigh didn't continue to say anything. He knew from the beginning that Arthur had his own choice, but ah. Uh, for Rayleigh, he watched Arthur grow up and really treated Arthur like his own child. And. Never mind. Never mind. In the end Rayleigh didn't say anything, just smiled, Arthur, the party is about to start, let's go. No problem. Mr. Rayleigh. Arthur was also smiling, knowing exactly what Mr. Rayleigh meant. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. Every day five changes. Fourth update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. 
Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 23, The Roger Pirates. Advertisement. Ha ha ha. Little ones. Superior. Roger waved your ace in his hand and let out a deafening laugh, and with Roger's big laugh, the entire Roger pirate group launched an attack at the same time. Brush. Brush. One after another figures rushed directly into the country. Defense. Defense. As the general of the country, at this moment, he is quickly commanding the soldiers of his country to fight back, and some powerful people in the country have also joined the battlefield. Only. A result is a result. Not an opponent at all. Um. Don't be kidding, this is the Roger Pirates. As one of the three legendary pirate groups in the world, you can defeat it with just one country? This is just like a joke, this is impossible, okay. This is not a joke, but this is a fact. Because of this, the result of this country is beyond doubt. Advertisement. Brush. Brush. Arthur's offensive was very fast, and a demon fruit power of Zoan Cat Cat Fruit had already fallen under Arthur's curry stick. Tick. Tick. Looking at the dripping blood, Arthur was very calm. He just flicked the blood stained on the curry stick in his hand, and his whole body was filled with calmness. I, in your eyes, you are innocent, but the same. You need to pay the price for what you have done. Fist of Power. And at this moment, a tall figure descended directly from the sky, punching a man into the deep pit. Wow! The man vomited out a mouthful of blood mixed with internal organs, his face turned pale instantly, his head tilted, and he lost his life directly. Bullet turned his head, grinning at the corners of his mouth, and said ferociously, Arthur! Why are you talking so much about this kind of rubbish? Arthur shook his head and said, just chatting casually. For them, they have done such a thing, so. They need to pay for it. In this sea, no one can touch the Roger Pirates. People without paying the price. Ha ha ha. That's right. Bullet became more ferocious, while he jumped up and rushed directly into the crowd. Arthur shook his head, slashed the throat of the Cat Malfruit ability user, and also joined the battlefield. The war is still going on, this country is called, Kingdom of Rasht. New World is a well-known country. This country is a member country of the world government. Its owners are very powerful and have abundant supplies. It can be said. Its status is still very high. Advertisement. Only. The Kingdom of Rasht is indeed dying. Yaman of the Roger Pirates arrived in the Kingdom of Rosh to replenish supplies, and the result. This king actually ordered Yaman to be arrested? Ah! It's not a brain problem, what is this? The result is needless to say. No. The Roger Pirates directly launched an attack on the entire country, and now the country has been beaten obediently and honestly, how many people? It doesn't matter how many people you have in a place where monsters like the Roger Pirates congregate. Roger, Rayleigh, Arthur, Bullet, yes. Right. And Shanks. All of these are awakened conquerors hacky, seriously. Except for the Rocks Pirate back then, there is no one in the sea with so many conquerors hacky like the Roger Pirates. So. With so many conquerors hacky, do you think the so-called miscellaneous fish and cannon fodder are useful? Just kidding. Go away, Laozi. With a loud roar, Roger directly cut off the enemy in front of him with a single knife, and at the same time, he shouted loudly, Jabba, is Yaman rescued? Jabba nodded in the distance, no problem. Yaman has been rescued. It is good. Roger nodded and then continued to charge into the crowd. Joke. Advertisement. Is that how he left? Stop it. Roger is not a good guy, since you dare to provoke Laozi's people. 
so. Lao Zi will not show mercy, since he has gone to sea as a pirate, he will do certain things. Even guys like the Roger pirates may not casually attack ordinary people, but they will still rob a country. After all, being a pirate always costs money, and where does the money come from? Or collect protection fees like the future four emperors. But, that is the four emperors of the future. The current pirates are generally not very interested in this aspect. The current pirates are basically wandering and sailing on the sea. Under such circumstances, to make money, then, naturally, it is robbery, and the Roger pirates are no exception. Every now and then, they will find a rich country to get a fortune. And the king is also very sensible. Guys like the Roger pirates must not be able to provoke him, so just give the money directly and it's over, and the money will be avoided. Besides, the Roger pirates basically just spend enough money, and don't need to spend much money. The results of it? Now someone actually took the initiative to find the head? Joke. If this is acceptable, then the guys from the Roger pirates are not the Roger pirates. It was a complete massacre of the quartet, and almost all the high-level officials of the entire country were slaughtered. This war gradually came to an end. Ugh. Arthur also shook his head helplessly at this, and said with emotion, it's really a group of people who look like they are dying. Why are there so many people without heads in this sea? Seriously. Arthur just felt that it was outrageous, not because of them feeling sad, but just wondering, is there something wrong with these people's heads? Always do such idiotic things. But, Arthur was too lazy to think about it so much. After this incident, Captain Roger felt that he and others were too quiet, so any bull, horse, snake god would dare to make trouble, just right? Let's make a fuss. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. Every day five changes. Fifth update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 24, The Famous Apprentice Quad Advertisement Ha 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 Up Up It's gone up again. Wearing a ponytail, the handsome Spencer held the reward order and said with a big smile, Captain Roger, Deputy Captain Rayleigh, the reward orders have increased again, and our overall reward orders have increased a lot. It went up again. Let me see. Everyone gathered around, and everyone couldn't help laughing when they saw everyone's reward orders. Awesome. That's right. Ha ha ha. Everyone was laughing. For pirates like them, the most important thing is their reputation. Except for timid pirates like Nami and Usopp, actually. Basically all pirates attach great importance to their bounties, including Chopper, who attach great importance to bounties. Not to mention, they are one of the three legendary pirate groups. For big shots like them, it's a big deal to offer bounties one by one, just kidding. Everyone is of the same status. If I offer a lower bounty than you, does it mean that I am weaker than you? This is definitely unacceptable. Ha ha ha. Advertisement. With a big laugh, Roger said boldly, boys. The party is on. Oh who? For pirates, what they like the most is the increase in their bounties, and the second favorite is the banquet. Now that the two are combined, of course it is the most exciting. One by one, they immediately started to prepare lively stand-up. The other side. Duolingo, who was relatively short, came over and said, Arthur, Bullet, Shanks, Buggy, the banquet is ready. Your training will end here. Huh. Arthur let out a long breath and said, 
Mr. Duolingo, it will be over soon. Um. Bullet didn't say anything, just nodded. Shanks is also desperately persevering, and seeing the other three people not stop, of course Buggy has no choice but to continue to persevere. Under the leadership of these three guys, Buggy's strength is simply explosive increase. No way. Buggy didn't want to work so hard, but seeing that the other three were working so hard, if he didn't work hard, wouldn't he be too ashamed? Therefore, Buggy, who had no choice, was finally forced to start working hard. Really are. Seeing that no one stopped, Duolingo also shook his head, and said helplessly, these four little guys. Each one is working harder than the other. Yes. Meyer Pine, who was wearing the horned helmet of the Vikings, also shook his head helplessly and said, it really makes people Alexander. If one day, we guys are surpassed by these four brats, it would be too shameful. Ha ha ha. That's right. Advertisement. Peter, who was wearing a hat, nodded in agreement, and these guys gathered together to discuss, looking at the hard-working four-person trainee pirate group, they couldn't help smiling. Ha ha ha. Everyone is laughing, but... Their smiles are filled with boldness and praise. This is their companion, this is their children, and such children are the most outstanding. Soon. The training is over, and the banquet has really started. Drink. Hurry up. You trash. Ha ha ha. These guys, one by one, drank heavily and ate meat, and soon some of them started to get drunk, while the four little guys sat down separately. It has been a whole year since they received the gift, close to two year time. Arthur, Shanks, Buggy are all 11 years old now, and Bullet is 17 years old. Seriously. In the past two years, because Bullet has surpassed the first stage of development, he has entered the stage of rapid development. He has completely left Shanks and Buggy behind, and the two sides are no longer on the same level. And what about Arthur? Um. In the past two years, Arthur has developed the blood of the Red Dragon to 20%, so it can't be seen by normal people, but... Even so, it's been almost three months since Arthur and Bullet have really tried their best to compete. Who is the stronger and weaker of the two now? This matter. It's really hard to say, after all. The talents of these two little devils can be said to be more terrifying than the other. Who knows what level these two guys have reached. Therefore. Advertisement. The rocket-like improvement speed of Arthur and Bullet can be said to be very exciting to Shanks. Shanks also started to exercise crazily and hard. Driven by Shanks, Buggy can't afford to lose this person. Um. Rolled up again. Fun. Fun. One by one got drunk, even Shanks and Buggy gradually drank in a daze, only Arthur and Bullet, the two of them seemed to have nothing to do, mainly because Bullet seldom drank, he just tasted it a little after all. That's what Bullet's character is. For Bullet, he has always been like this, he used to be a soldier, drinking on the battlefield, it was like dying. And what about Arthur? That's purely because the blood of the Red Dragon is quite special, even if you drink a lot, there will basically be no problems. Huh. Letting out a long breath, Arthur put down the wine glass in his hand, and murmured, speaking of which, Bullet, we still haven't been offered a reward this time. Indeed. Bullet also put down his wine glass, he drank very little, he just drank a bottle of wine, nodded and said, normally, although the four of us are apprentice pirates, we should also be rewarded. At this point, Bullet found it quite strange. In the past two years, the four-member team of Roger Pirates' famous trainee pirates has resounded across the sea. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. Every day five changes. The first update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation. 
celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate Recharge, Activity Time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement Chapter 24, The Famous Apprentice Quad Advertisement Ha ha ha! Up! Up! It's gone up again! Wearing a ponytail, the handsome Spencer held the reward order and said with a big smile, Captain Roger, Deputy Captain Rayleigh, the reward orders have increased again, and our overall reward orders have increased a lot. It went up again. Let me see. Everyone gathered around, and everyone couldn't help laughing when they saw everyone's reward orders. Awesome. That's right. Ha ha ha. Everyone was laughing. For pirates like them, the most important thing is their reputation. Except for timid pirates like Nami and Usopp, actually. Basically all pirates attach great importance to their bounties, including Chopper, who attach great importance to bounties. Not to mention. They are one of the three legendary pirate groups. For big shots like them, it's a big deal to offer bounties one by one, just kidding. Everyone is of the same status. If I offer a lower bounty than you, does it mean that I am weaker than you? This is definitely unacceptable. Ha ha ha. Advertisement. With a big laugh, Roger said boldly, Boys. The party is on. Oh who? For pirates, what they like the most is the increase in their bounties, and the second favorite is the banquet. Now that the two are combined, of course it is the most exciting. One by one, they immediately started to prepare lively stand-up. The other side. Duolingo, who was relatively short, came over and said, Arthur, Bullet, Shanks, Buggy, the banquet is ready. Your training will end here. Huh. Arthur let out a long breath and said, Mr. Duolingo, it will be over soon. Um. Bullet didn't say anything, just nodded. Shanks is also desperately persevering, and seeing the other three people not stop, of course Buggy has no choice but to continue to persevere. Under the leadership of these three guys, Buggy's strength is simply explosive increase. No way. Buggy didn't want to work so hard, but seeing that the other three were working so hard, if he didn't work hard, wouldn't he be too ashamed? Therefore, Buggy, who had no choice, was finally forced to start working hard. Really are. Seeing that no one stopped, Duolingo also shook his head, and said helplessly, these four little guys. Each one is working harder than the other. Yes. Meyer Pine, who was wearing the horned helmet of the Vikings, also shook his head helplessly and said, it really makes people Alexander. If one day, we guys are surpassed by these four brats, it would be too shameful. Ha ha ha. That's right. Advertisement. Peter, who was wearing a hat, nodded in agreement, and these guys gathered together to discuss, looking at the hard-working four-person trainee pirate group, they couldn't help smiling. Ha ha ha. Everyone is laughing, but... Their smiles are filled with boldness and praise. This is their companion, this is their children, and such children are the most outstanding. Soon. The training is over, and the banquet has really started. Drink. Hurry up. You trash. Ha ha ha. These guys, one by one, drank heavily and ate meat, and soon some of them started to get drunk, while the four little guys sat down separately. It has been a whole year since they received the gift, close to two year time. Arthur, Shanks, Buggy are all 11 years old now, and Bullet is 17 years old. Seriously. In the past two years, because Bullet has surpassed the first stage of development, he has entered the stage of rapid development. He has completely left Shanks and Buggy behind, and the two sides are no longer on the same level. And what about Arthur? Um. In the past two years, 
Arthur has developed the blood of the Red Dragon to 20%, so it can't be seen by normal people, but... Even so, it's been almost three months since Arthur and Bullet have really tried their best to compete. Who is the stronger and weaker of the two now? This matter. It's really hard to say, after all. The talents of these two little devils can be said to be more terrifying than the other. Who knows what level these two guys have reached. Therefore. Advertisement. The rocket-like improvement speed of Arthur and Bullet can be said to be very exciting to Shanks. Shanks also started to exercise crazily and hard. Driven by Shanks, Buggy can't afford to lose this person. Um. Rolled up again. Fun. Fun. One by one got drunk, even Shanks and Buggy gradually drank in a daze, only Arthur and Bullet, the two of them seemed to have nothing to do, mainly because Bullet seldom drank, he just tasted it a little after all. That's what Bullet's character is. For Bullet, he has always been like this, he used to be a soldier, drinking on the battlefield, it was like dying. And what about Arthur? That's purely because the blood of the Red Dragon is quite special, even if you drink a lot, there will basically be no problems. Huh. Letting out a long breath, Arthur put down the wine glass in his hand, and murmured, speaking of which, Bullet, we still haven't been offered a reward this time. Indeed. Bullet also put down his wine glass, he drank very little, he just drank a bottle of wine, nodded and said, normally, although the four of us are apprentice pirates, we should also be rewarded. At this point, Bullet found it quite strange. In the past two years, the four-member team of Roger Pirates' famous trainee pirates has resounded across the sea. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. Every day five changes. The first update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyu Evaluation. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons. Immediate Recharge, Activity Time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 24, The Famous Apprentice Quad. Advertisement. Ha ha ha. Up. Up. It's gone up again. Wearing a ponytail, the handsome Spencer held the reward order and said with a big smile, Captain Roger, Deputy Captain Rayleigh, the reward orders have increased again, and our overall reward orders have increased a lot. It went up again. Let me see. Everyone gathered around, and everyone couldn't help laughing when they saw everyone's reward orders. Awesome. That's right. Ha ha ha. Everyone was laughing. For pirates like them, the most important thing is their reputation. Except for timid pirates like Nami and Usopp, actually. Basically all pirates attach great importance to their bounties, including Chopper, who attach great importance to bounties. Not to mention. They are one of the three legendary pirate groups. For big shots like them, it's a big deal to offer bounties one by one, just kidding. Everyone is of the same status. If I offer a lower bounty than you, does it mean that I am weaker than you? This is definitely unacceptable. Ha ha ha. Advertisement. With a big laugh, Roger said boldly, Boys. The party is on. Oh who? For pirates, what they like the most is the increase in their bounties, and the second favorite is the banquet. Now that the two are combined, of course it is the most exciting. One by one, they immediately started to prepare lively stand-up. The other side. Duolingo, who was relatively short, came over and said, Arthur, Bullet, Shanks, Buggy, the banquet is ready. Your training will end here. Huh. Arthur let out a long breath and said, Mr. Duolingo, it will be over soon. Um. Bullet didn't say anything, just nodded. Shanks is also desperately persevering, 
and seeing the other three people not stop, of course Buggy has no choice but to continue to persevere. Under the leadership of these three guys, Buggy's strength is simply explosive increase. No way. Buggy didn't want to work so hard, but seeing that the other three were working so hard, if he didn't work hard, wouldn't he be too ashamed? Therefore, Buggy, who had no choice, was finally forced to start working hard. Really are. Seeing that no one stopped, Duolingo also shook his head, and said helplessly, these four little guys. Each one is working harder than the other. Yes. Meyer Pine, who was wearing the horned helmet of the Vikings, also shook his head helplessly and said, it really makes people Alexander. If one day, we guys are surpassed by these four brats, it would be too shameful. Ha ha ha. That's right. Advertisement. Peter, who was wearing a hat, nodded in agreement, and these guys gathered together to discuss, looking at the hard-working four-person trainee pirate group, they couldn't help smiling. Ha ha ha. Everyone is laughing, but... Their smiles are filled with boldness and praise. This is their companion, this is their children, and such children are the most outstanding. Soon. The training is over, and the banquet has really started. Drink. Hurry up. You trash. Ha ha ha. These guys, one by one, drank heavily and ate meat, and soon some of them started to get drunk, while the four little guys sat down separately. It has been a whole year since they received the gift, close to two year time. Arthur, Shanks, Buggy are all 11 years old now, and Bullet is 17 years old. Seriously. In the past two years, because Bullet has surpassed the first stage of development, he has entered the stage of rapid development. He has completely left Shanks and Buggy behind, and the two sides are no longer on the same level. And what about Arthur? Um. In the past two years, Arthur has developed the blood of the Red Dragon to 20%, so it can't be seen by normal people, but... Even so, it's been almost three months since Arthur and Bullet have really tried their best to compete. Who is the stronger and weaker of the two now? This matter. It's really hard to say, after all. The talents of these two little devils can be said to be more terrifying than the other. Who knows what level these two guys have reached. Therefore. Advertisement. The rocket-like improvement speed of Arthur and Bullet can be said to be very exciting to Shanks. Shanks also started to exercise crazily and hard. Driven by Shanks, Buggy can't afford to lose this person. Um. Rolled up again. Fun. Fun. One by one got drunk, even Shanks and Buggy gradually drank in a daze, only Arthur and Bullet, the two of them seemed to have nothing to do, mainly because Bullet seldom drank, he just tasted it a little after all. That's what Bullet's character is. For Bullet, he has always been like this, he used to be a soldier, drinking on the battlefield, it was like dying. And what about Arthur? That's purely because the blood of the Red Dragon is quite special, even if you drink a lot, there will basically be no problems. Huh. Letting out a long breath, Arthur put down the wine glass in his hand, and murmured, speaking of which, Bullet, we still haven't been offered a reward this time. Indeed. Bullet also put down his wine glass, he drank very little, he just drank a bottle of wine, nodded and said, normally, although the four of us are apprentice pirates, we should also be rewarded. At this point, Bullet found it quite strange. In the past two years, the four-member team of Roger Pirates' famous trainee pirates has resounded across the sea. P.S. Zioking's new book is uploaded. Every day five changes. The first update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo Evaluation. Celebrate the seven-day-long holiday of National Day and enjoy reading books. Recharge 100 and get 500 VIP coupons.
immediate recharge, activity time, October 1st to October 7th. Advertisement. Chapter 25, Mad Dog Encirclement and Suppression. Sakazuki. Advertisement. Arthur Pendragon. Douglas Bullet. Shanks. Buggy. These four people, as the four apprentice pirates of the Roger Pirates, followed the troubles of the Roger Pirates on the sea in the past two years, and these four little ghosts also resounded through the sea, after all. They are really strong. Many cotters of the pirate group are not the opponents of these four little ghosts, and it turns out. It has been almost two years, and the strangest thing is that none of the four people has been offered a reward. Even Bullet was offered a reward after destroying his own country and army, now. Not only did the bounty offer not increase, but the original bounty order was revoked, which is outrageous. He he he. Listening to the conversation between Arthur and Bullet, Rayleigh walked over and said with a chuckle, this matter is actually quite easy to understand, for Marine. The reputation of the Roger Pirates is already great. If you just just as a trainee pirate, if it is equally powerful, it will deal too much damage to Marine's prestige, and it will also greatly increase our reputation. Mr. Rayleigh. Executive Captain Rayleigh. After the two greeted each other separately, Bullet said with disdain, it's really Marine's work. Such a conspiracy, I don't even dare to admit the strength of the other party. Obviously. Bullet doesn't really have a dime of affection for Marine, and even for Bullet, Marine is a bunch of nasty trash. Arthur felt very calm about this, thought for a while, and said, Mr. Rayleigh, I don't care whether there is a reward or not, but? According to Marine's character, or in other words, according to Naval Headquarters Hero Vice Admiral, Garp's character, hasn't it been three months? Advertisement. Um. Mentioning this matter, Rayleigh also said with a serious expression, Garp has not appeared for three months. This is a very serious problem, after all. According to the character of that old mad dog, I'm afraid. Boom. Boom. There is a very good saying, which is called CAO CAO, CAO CAO will arrive, and when the three people were discussing, suddenly, under the night, the roar of artillery fire resounded at the same time. Um. What? What? The members of the Roger Pirates were still drunk just now, but at this moment they regained their spirits in an instant. Everyone jumped up, and with the roar of artillery fire, the shells fired one after another. It was cut instantly. Ha ha ha. Accompanied by this familiar laughter, everyone knew who was here. Really are. Garp put his arms around his chest, wearing the coat that represented justice, and said proudly, Laozi deliberately found such an opportunity, Roger. You guys, you react very quickly. Old Mad Dog. Roger couldn't tell from his current appearance that he was drunk just now. He grinned at the corner of his mouth and said ferociously, You old Mad Dog. Today, Laozi will definitely kill you. Laozi will definitely arrest you today. Come. Try it. God avoids. Fistbone meteorite. Roger and Garp, the two of them just said a few words, and they had already fought together in an instant, just kidding. No matter how good-tempered Roger is, he was irritated this time. For pirates, the banquet is very important. The results of it? How dare you come to Laozi's door when he is having a banquet and kill you guy? With the start of the war between Roger and Garp, this war has also completely kicked off. Search. Boom. The cannonballs were released in an instant. Both sides knew each other very well, and the fighting methods and positioning were very high-end operations. Only. Arthur was keenly aware of something, and turned his head suddenly. At this moment, Jabba jumped up, holding an axe in both hands, and the amazing armament hacky was attached, and the moment that figure fell, it was already captured blocked. The fist and the axe collided, 
and this was a man wearing purple sunglasses. He grinned and said, Jabba. You guys react very quickly. Zephyr. Jabba showed a slight difference, and then grinned at the corner of his mouth, and said ferociously, Laozi just said, why is the old mad dog so honest these past few months, so he planned to play a big game. But. Just you two guys. Just relying on you two guys, but you can't win Laozi and others. Yes. Advertisement. The corners of Zephyr's mouth grinned, and at this moment, a figure gradually emerged, even under the night, it shone with dazzling golden light. It was a huge Buddha with one hand in his palm, instantly between them, an invisible shockwave directly penetrated. Brush. Rayleigh jumped up, holding a long knife, and his astonishing slash directly split the shockwave in front of him into two, blocking this astonishing attack. Sengoku. Rayleigh. Rayleigh didn't talk nonsense, and went straight to Sengoku, and Jabba and Zephyr also fought quickly. In a short time, the entire Roger Pirates found their opponents. Arthur observed the battlefield, looked at the surrounding situation, and said secretly, Sengoku, Zephyr, Garp, these three people actually shot at the same time. It seems. Captain Roger's troubles in the past two years also brought about the butterfly effect. This era, for Marine, is a very special era, very few, and there is no era of three admirals. Sengoku Sengoku. Black Arm Zephyr. Iron Fist Garp. These three people are two admirals and one vice admiral, but they constitute the three major powers of this era, and everyone agrees, because although Garp is not admiral, Garp is a real naval headquarters hero vice admiral, and this status is beyond doubt. At this time, all pirates should be wiped out. Hearing this extreme voice, Arthur turned his head and saw a familiar figure, hmm. Red Dog Sakazuki. P.S. Zio King's new book is uploaded. Every day five changes. The second update. Begging for collection. Beg for flowers. Begging for a monthly pass. Begging for a reward. Gaikyo evaluation.